Hello everybody, to welcome to Season 50 CCL Round of 16 match between Rick Reckless and Tempest Soul. Um, and we've started off with a casualty here for oh. Rick. That's pretty that brutal, is, isn't it? It is good skink as well. Yep, it is wonder skink. Oh, um, oh no, it's an MNG! And he has with the it. Oh, I thought oh you had Oh my god. He has not apoed it. Oh, he did not apple because it's the MNG. Wow. Well, I think he probably wow. had to. Um, I could not agree more. Yep, it's a God, horrible matchup was... for Rick. He's he's down a bunch of TV. He's got Silly Billy. Um, there's only 12 players. And yeah, he's against Dark Elves with Lizards. So this is a real tough matchup, and he's just lost oh, his best skink. <laughs> that's well, that's not a great start. Uh, hello, Jim. How are you? Sorry. Hello. Not bad, busy thanks. React. <laughs> busy reacting to poor old skin getting hit. Yes, yeah, in the booth with me is Kalon and Purple Chest. Hello. Hello. Yeah, how are you? Jesus, that's a horrible start for poor old Rick. Brutal. Um, brutal, yeah. Would we have appoed that, lads? 100% I would. Um, I, I'm with Jim. I think you start behind the eight ball in this game. And I think you need to find a way to, to high roll to take chances that can come off. Yeah. And one of them was the 50% of that skin still being alive. Yes. Yes, I, I agree. Oh no, he's G failed his GFI on his... I really don't like these GFIs because no. he can't get the ball this turn. No, right? he can't. No. Yeah. So... And it, I mean, it, the death of that skink leaves you nothing in the backfield with elves coming at you. It's it's awful yeah. situation. To yeah, me. that's the thing, yeah. Even if you apo it, you're still, you're still yeah. in a horrendous situation this drive. That's... Yeah. Almost game lost. Almost game over before it's it started, but it's not. It's not over yet. No, of don't course. say There's it's over. There's plenty of stuff to happen, and I, I mean, it's just it's an interest because you were realizing that it's obviously he's in a losing situation, so he was willing to put in. Oh, it's a sneaky gate. He got a sneaky gate. <laughs> yeah, so that's it's why you threw in the foul at the end. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's pretty fucking hilarious. I mean, there is another god tier kink on the pitch. It, it all is by is. no means lost. There's a strength three somewhere knocking around, isn't yep. there? Yeah, he's the, there he's is the ball, strength yeah. three wrestle, but he's wrestle as well, and he doesn't have sure hands, and he doesn't have. Uh, yeah. Yep. I and mean, he's fine. And because he GFI'd, he's wasted one of his rerolls essentially. Because like, it just it yeah. could it could have been here. Like, you know, he'd have been yeah. screened. It wouldn't have been easily yeah. based or anything. And he could have come and picked it up. Like, I can see what he's thinking. You know, if he makes both GFIs, he's got another chance at the pickup. But yeah. I think you have to just not GFI because you have to reroll the GFIs. Right, yeah. that's the killer. Yes, I, I mean, think might... you might need you know all your pieces up, active, and able to do things next turn. So. I'd have kept the reroll safe for that because Rick's very low on rerolls. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just this build. Just stand him there and just realise that you lose one time out of nine next turn. Like that's okay, yeah. isn't it? That's an acceptable yeah, risk. So some turn, some turn. In this, in the risk profile of this game, I think it, it sadly is. I mean, it, we'd all wish it wasn't, but. And now, of course, the team is is split in directly into. Yeah. Uh, Tempest told us all taking exactly the position that you know you would want to. Yep. Um, lovely positioning there. You know, not difficult to do, but he absolutely put them in the right squares so far. Mm -hmm. yep. And now it is icing on the cake. Anything from here? I mean, I'd love to see, yeah, this one yeah, reinforced lovely, with the other yeah. witch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then, oh, yeah. yeah. That's just brutal, isn't it? I mean, where do you go even if you get the damn ball? Are they all side? No, there's a one guy in the middle is not sidestep, and the rest of them are. What an absolute fucking nightmare! Yep, five side. The key steps. difference here to the last um, lizard game we watched, where Silly Billy was on. Here, of course, Silly Billy is the sixth Saurus, so we are Ooh. still seeing four skinks on the pitch. So we've lost one, but have three. <laughs> so that limits the amount of just power anyway. Um, this this lizard team, I mean, it, it's very tiny. It's got some nice things, lots of block all over it, a few guards, two great skinks. But the underdeveloped Sauruses lack, brutally lack, um, tackles, any ability to deal with these elves reasonably. Yep. Um, yep. Rick's in a spot. He is. He was in a spot at the start, hence being down enough to be able to get uh, yeah. Silly Billy. And um, yeah, it's just, not getting, it's just not getting any easier from here. But you can blitz this guy and then bring he all can. this stuff down here and then bring yep. all this stuff up here. Yeah, so he's, or, yeah or, the right or, hand of the pitch seems to be the place to go, go, but... Is he going to go the Just, other way instead? I, yeah, it seems we're going to the left of the pitch. Seems a little harder, but... It does manage to get the Crocs a little bit more involved as well if he does decide to go this line. Yeah. There is that plus agility, sidestepping tack tackle piece there, though. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Um, but the oh good God, thing is that um, Silly Billy's actually moved seven, lads, so he's able to kind of, <laughs> you know, get all the yes, way up around the side there, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah this, gets him, this gets him further forward. 
Um, go on this side, doesn't it? But yeah, in danger of the tackler, whereas this way would have got him less far forward. Mm -hmm. Then these were closer to support, so it's probably six and two threes apart yeah. from the tackler. Oh, and wow. He's not Ken reminded cage. me of that early, earlier game, Jim. We've got another team without any absolute standout stars. I mean, obviously the plus agility blitzer catches the eye, but he's, he's only plus agility and normals. Yep. Um, yep. The witches are normals. There's a leap sidestep block Ooh. and a sidestep block. Um, it, it's all just built on really normal, low TV, non-bloating skills. Yep. And yet it's it's very dangerous looking, isn't it? Yeah, this it is. The five blood step just looks terrifying, doesn't it? I think that's mm -hmm. you know, that's the thing that looks that looks very horrible <laughs> for a lot of teams. And chip any two elves? Have you really made a lot of difference to it? Not really. You know, no. It's got strength and depth, hasn't it? That's the beautiful yeah, thing. Yeah. yeah, it's a really nicely put together team, um, which is great because it doesn't have a huge amount of extras. Just the uh, the one agility guy, uh, no guard. Um, it's but got it's one up crazy. here, but he's uh, he, he was hit ah, by yeah. the rock, funnily enough. He was, but yeah. But not killed. <laughs> okay. Well, that helps somewhat, having that guy there. Um, but... Yeah, no yeah, strength, no move. It, it is quite an ask. I was not at all happy to see the sideline cage when you're playing against elves, especially with an edge boy like that, but... Yeah, he's um, got sidestep on him, so... He it does, is yeah. It is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Now, here's where my uh, leapy witch would have wrestle, which I think would be more useful in this matchup. But, um, I don't know. I mean, that skink's got wrestle too, so on a both down, it has to take it. Yep. Yes, it's one of those things, isn't it? If, you, if, you, it if you're going to go leap, then, yeah, maybe you should have taken wrestle. I don't really... Like, I wouldn't take leap on a bloodstep wolf. But, um, so that, you know, it is what it is, isn't it? Well, it, it's also different, right? Because ideally you would have... Because this is the way he builds them as well. He builds two block witches. Uh, I, I, I'm a big fan of wrestle witch. Um, but he doesn't like them, and he tends to go for leap on them as well. Yeah, that's weird. He tends to kind of build a war dancer is pretty much what yeah. he does with them. If you want another controversial hot take, Ugh. I'm going to say that I think the guard elf is one of the least relevant. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not a lot of use guard against sauruses. Uh, I, I'm not sure whether it's going to get into places where it's useful against the skinks. Yeah, it's on the ground, sort of distant from things. I don't mind it being there if I'm the elf. It's, I'm not in any danger. For sure. I mean, it is handy getting one dice instead of red dice, right? Yes. I mean, I'm not saying it's a bad piece. I just, it, it's not got any block. It's going to get hit to pieces For if sure. it does stand up and get involved. Mm -hmm. um, and I just don't think it's as useful as it is against a strength three team. Sure. Is, is he going to go for the surf? Yeah. I, I mean, it's, it's doable, isn't it? That's the, that's, the, that's the thing. And I think he can probably do it. So it's a five in the front, it's a four in the four in the front, and a five in the back. Oh, no, no, he could just he could just put two here, right? He could just put two here, and okay. then come in with a witch, and then push it to there, and then oh, it, it, it there can't sidestep yeah. again. It can't. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. But obviously, you lose, the witch, you lose the witch, witch leaps because yeah. it's a three in here. You would lose your witch after, so that it wouldn't be that good. <laughs> mm -hmm. And you'd have well, to cancel I mean, this assist somehow. Would you? Yeah. So. Because again, she's sidestep, so you'd have to put a lot of things around her to get her lost. But you, you, that, you've got a packet to surf him. You're surely going to be in him. panic recover the ball mode. You'd have to pack it to surf him, wouldn't you? So, yeah, I guess. I guess. Yeah. I mean, you're right. It, it only takes one skink move to surf her afterwards, doesn't it? Yeah. And then Silly Billy could just surf her. But that skink might be vital because the ball's going to be somewhere. Yes, yeah. I, mean, I, I think it's probably not worth I think it's probably not worth going for the ball. So it's a good, good turn from Rick, wasn't it? That he's made it like it not was, worth going for the ball. I, I don't think if it's it was wrestle, so. I'd, If it was wrestle, I'd go for it. <laughs> yeah. it but how do you make it a 1D? Like, you know, it's not easy. You'd have, you've got sure. a dungeon and a 4 plus to make it a 1D, and you've got all these people over here. I think that was a mm -hmm. real good turn from Rick. For sure. Well, considering the, the bind he found himself in, I thought it was, yeah, about yeah, great well, safer than I thought it was going to be, so a great turn. Yeah, incredible. However, he still has a team cut completely in half because the Dark Elves have reinforced that facet in their moving this turn. Instead of coming for the ball, they've recut the team in half, and we've still got three Sauruses um, sort of abandoned from the rest of the team and struggling to get back involved, and now a stunned Crocs, so it's not getting any easier for A me. stunned mm. Crocs? You're not watching my stream then, PC. Ah, oh, sorry, I've got a little bit ahead of you. I'm watching have, on my yeah. clone. Yeah. Yeah. Oops. We only just got the, the cracks stunned. Yeah, so... Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now, now, yeah, he's now he's as PC says he's re-split his team. Yep. <laughs> and well, I mean, he had before the stunning of the cross, but the stunning of the cross really helps. And yeah, the plan was always to blitz it and at least knock it over. Yeah, he had so that wasn't hard to do. But yes, yeah, sorry for the slight spoiler. There. Actually, no that's more discreet. No problem. Um, so yeah, yeah, yeah. This is yeah. He's in a pickle again. Yeah. Although he can stabilize pretty much where he is, but not move forwards. I mean, they have left him that. You mm, can, can blitz this side stepper, can't you? Yeah. If he powers this guy, move to the middle. Yep. He's going for the three D. Go for the three, which I really like. Yep. Well, I mean, he's got no tackle, so he's got to try and maximise his odds. And it does get all the Sauruses back together, which. If yeah. there's hope, it's in that, isn't it? And you're somewhere near the Crocs. I mean, it's, it's, it's I think, definitely the right play. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, with one reroll as well. So yeah, absolutely. Here. Love to see the. Um, uh, yes. Yeah. Way. I mean, either down or left to me are both yeah. aggressive in terms of where Rick wants to be. Mm. So does he want to dodge through the middle? No, he can't. Yeah, well, where, he wanted, all the way back around. where he wanted to cage would now leave the uh, the blockless Saurus as one of the corners of it. Mm -hmm. Rick might just stay where he is, but then if he stays where he is, maybe Temp maybe Soul this comes turn in he and, can yeah. look at the yeah. yeah. So now he has yeah he decides he has to move. Mm -hmm. Got to move, got to move, Rick. Which means he has to go far enough backwards. I mean, Dark Elves aren't super fast. No, but the ones by the uh, the midfield Saurus pair are the ones that worry me. The witch yep. and the uh, I was going to say the bloodstep blitzer, but that doesn't help, does it? <laughs> no, no, these two. Oh, yeah. it's a four in, Jim. Yeah, it is. Yeah, but but he's strength with, with... three, so you've got yeah. you've got to get a guy around here to get the two, and then it'll be a two into a one if you come with a witch. So I suppose you can just send the bloodstepper through, just. Let's do the three three. Well, the edge five could come in, could come in on a on a three, couldn't he? In a two tackle mm. zone, so he could come in there. So just one two D maybe. So interesting. You're not giving away a huge amount of thing if you actually just sent the bottom blood stepper in to dodge through all the way. So you could go three. You could go three three. Uh, sorry, you could go four three uh, two, and then stand on the bottom side of the skink, and then if you get there, then send the the tackle in. Yeah. And if you don't, then you're already in good fettle. Yeah. Three, three, two, or four, two, or four, two. Yeah, four, two. I like four, two is better. Yeah, three, three, two puts another mm -hmm. go for it on, doesn't it? One, one, yeah, two. you're right. Yeah, yeah, four, yeah, so yeah it does. Four, two. So four, yep. two. It's a one in four to fail the four, and you're not moving anything else first. Was mm -hmm. what was attractive about that? About that. Yes. Yeah. So you know you've got a pretty solid defence up there. You could have left everything in place, tried the four-two, and if the four-two works, suddenly you're on with a decent ball sack. Well, he's moved the edge five tackle. Yeah, yeah I think like he's decided he's, it's not worth it. He's just going to go to take some hits here instead. Yeah. He's Which got the pin to the backfield. He's lost no elves. He's got by far the stronger team. Yeah. At some point, if Rick comes forward, there's just not enough guard or tackle on these sauruses to make you think they're going to keep the ball safe. Yeah, yeah, this is pretty nice. He can, he can just, he can just bully these Sauras while Rick has to has to scramble to protect the ball every turn. He can actually get ahead in the punching game potentially, at, le at least not fall behind. Whereas if he, if he did all things like tagging things and going for the ball, okay, he might get the ball, but then he also might just get banged out by two DBs rolling powers, mate. Yep, yep. I mean, having said that, Jimmy's moved half his team. We've still got a blitzer sandwich trapped. We've put no pressure on the cage. The Crocs is going to stand up in a position that's a little awkward. Um, it's it, it's not gone well so far this turn. No, no he was really I'm hoping for, the, for an uptick in fortune. On the, yeah, he on really the, was. The I'd have blitzed this guy with Russell. In. I'd have blitzed this guy with Russell, but uh, mm -hmm. this works fine. I wonder if he's just clearing he's the, the guard. He's putting the guard yeah, in. Yeah, he's putting the guard in. He's going to try and knock him all over still. Okay. Yeah. This is two into one. But he can make it two into two, can't he? But then he... Puts another guy on the on the uh, crocs if he does that. Mm -hmm. um, if he, he takes down the blockless lizard him. first, it's two into two, isn't it? Yeah, so yeah, he does that. He'll probably do and that isolates first. the crocs. Oh, more, doing that. Both of which I would like to see. Hmm. Okay, well that still makes it two into two. It does, but your guard is in pretty favourable position. Mm. And he still needs to put somebody in he here to push him anyway. Right? Bunch that guy, yeah. Yeah, and as I said, if you did it on the blockless saurus and it worked, you had your mm -hmm. two into two. Yeah. 
and a spare player. Yeah. So a bit. Uh, and he never puts one there anyway. Yeah, exactly. Well, he had to to get the two D, didn't he? That was the thing. Yeah. So, yeah, he should have just done that first, then done the witch. Yeah. And then it was two into two and had a, a spare elf to do something else with. Ideally, to come in front of this crocs slightly to the left. Yes. Because that's where I'm going if I'm Rick. I'd stand the crocs up, and if it works, I'm probably heading up there. But... <laughs> yeah, oh, it I seems mean, horrible, isn't it? Really giving away nice the on the... Here. I, I know you said he wasn't as as big a deal this game, game but um, giving away the hit on the, uh, on the guard there. Um, oh, we're going even rowdier, right up the sideline. Mm. Okay. Mm. Mm. Well, I'd certainly have tried the... Oh, then we must be Crocs blitzing. Mm -hmm. That does seem yep. like a Rick thing to do. It does, it does seem indeed. like a Rick thing to do. Yep. And it's blitzing a blockless elf, which is a nice yep. little target for it, and it will get it back involved in the ball area, which is nice. Mm -hmm. Make like a double screen. Yeah. Okay. Boom. Oh, get to the power. Get, get mighty blood, son. Not. Ooh. I think that's the square I would have wanted the crocs in. Yeah, but I'd, it, I'd want the crocs up. I'd want the crocs up. Too. It gives silly Billy a, a nice hit. Oh, he's in! Well. Oh, wow! He's in. That's oof, very, yeah. very aggressive. I was going to say he's coming back in on the elves, isn't he? Yes, of course he is. It's Rick. Well, there's a double push here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's a Saurus hit on the guard elf, and if it yeah. if it pows, he can push the witch who can't sidestep back on the yeah. crocs. Yeah. I wonder if that's his. No, no he's always really. going to push his other Saurus. The, okay, well, I mean, it gets. There, right? The Saurus is more. I mean, it's tightened that elf pack up nicely. And it's, I guess it's, the Saurus it's, is over nearer the ball. Yeah, it strengthened it all up with the, all of the guard in position as well. Mm -hmm. Oof. But the agility elf flies into the middle of that side stall cage. Mm -hmm. Or upside, because it's sidestep. In off. Um, the skink it can get around there fairly easily. Yeah, get behind the skink, just stand up. You can't take. Can't, you, I mean, obviously, it's easier to get in from the front. It's a two but, three um, coming from the, behind the skink. Yeah, but the yeah, it, it's it's the fact that silly Billy has cards. So you don't want to hit him from five, that side. Six, either, seven, and to go for it if you do it that way. Yes. But it's 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 better because it's not too it's not too red because it is a yeah. strength three skink. Yes, yeah, that's the only way to one D is is stand mm -hmm. this guy up and come in from behind. Coming from behind, yeah. Wait. Yes, for those who can't recognise the Blood Bowl two star from a distance, that is silly Billy just ahead of the ball, and he does have guard, which is not marked on your screens because it's an inherent skill, not an earned skill. Yeah. And he can't get served because he's got stand firm. And if we put and all the inherent skills on, it looks ugly. It does, yeah. and he can keep up with the uh, ball as well because he's uh, move seven. Is he so move seven? Yeah, can't, yeah. can't quite though because I, I think yeah. skinks move eight, don't they? Kevin? Oh, they do. Yeah, but he can. He can. You know, so he's slow him compared behind. to a skink. He is. Yeah, but you know, just want to make sure that people know that um, he's, he's, he's move seven. It, it, it doesn't come up a lot. <laughs> See, that makes him more relevant in some matches. Mm, indeed. Yes, it's a lot more relevant against elves than uh, something else. What was the other match? We, we watched a match with... Uh, oh, it was against Elves, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Silly Billy versus Woody's, yeah. Woody. Yeah, it is, it is It is. It is. useful against Elves. Like, it's it's pretty irrelevant versus, like, Chaos or whatever, right? If you've got sure. Silly Billy. But, um, but against uh, Elves, the move seven is, is often dece. A funnily, much better against uh, Wood Elves as well, right? Uh, just because of their inherent ability to want to get into a fight and uh, the guard being much more valuable there. I mean, I don't I know. It's probably, it's probably just as good against Dark Elves as well, because like, then you become faster than a lot of the Dark Elves, don't you? So. A, a, a be True. Better, yeah. but what I said, uh, than, than against Wood Elves. Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm better a... Better than Wood Elves. I mean, the, but then Wood Elves are move seven as well, so it's like, it's it's six and two, three. It's like, it, it, it's just good against Elves because they're mobile. That's that's the big thing, yeah. right? Elves are mobile. So having, yeah. you know, fast players is better against mobile teams, which is, is why humans are quite decent against... Elves, even if they mm. still lose a fair bit, because yep. well, they're still elves. <laughs> yes, elves are decent against everything except other elves. Yeah, mm. and humans are fast, yo. They are Ooh. very fast. Might see a reroll here because this is a bit of a shit yeah. turn if he doesn't. I, yeah. Why? Right? Why? I. It's not I'm what confused I Confused by that, but yes. Uh, okay, we're getting the the trash elf off so that we can take the crocs down. I get that. Is this so they can get the other guys back out? Mm. Yeah, I think we're restabilizing ahead of the drive. Yeah. Yes, I, Bezel. So I thought Rick was guy. in more trouble than that. I still think he's got four Sauruses nailed down. 
Oh my god, this oh, Kraxagor is made oh, of paper. Oh god. Good lord. Oh, oh of course really it is. Good. It's Mash, the toxic ice cream man, who's been the biggest disappointment of a Kraxagor that uh, Rick has ever had. <laughs> but now, at least the apple joke. is guaranteed to At yep, least the yeah, apple is apple guaranteed does work, to you. So Rick was right. Work, yeah. yeah. Now we just have two plus outs everywhere, right? Thanks to the Crocs going down. <laughs> and he can screen all of this off and make next turn very, very uncomfortable for Rick. And probably still leave enough elves that almost all of those five Sauruses are stuck and can't come. Yeah. Mm. Uh, well, hey. Well, hey. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's just going to punch. He's just going to punch more. He he's really likes punch punching. Yep. Mad for the punching. I think this might have been a turn to punch a little bit less. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, 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 I'm going to call it over blocking now, Jim. Yeah. I didn't love the Crocs Blitz, despite it's wonderful. This one, this, this is too too many now. Yeah, for me. But it leaves everything like it, the next turn's better because of it, right? Because now these only stand up, and now everyone gets off next turn. It's just that, yeah. I mean, I, I'm Always with you. Upside. I'm with you that I would have, I would have just taken all these two plus dodges off and had like a big load in between here. Um, but you know, by banging down them, all of them, it's just incredible. Next turn's going to be incredible, but it'll it be too late but because particularly he's the blockless Saurus. Leaving that on a blodge piece wouldn't terrify me at all. No, let Whoa, me what a side Why wouldn't you? What Why a side wouldn't you stay on crazy place to go? That's absolutely yeah, insane. Like here or here? Do you think he doesn't here. know that? Uh, here? That silly believe Grab. <laughs> he's got grab. <laughs> he's got grab. Oh, he's got grab. Yeah. He's got uh, grab. Yeah, so cancels the sidestep. There we go. There we go. There you are. Even the silly Billy John the Baptist yeah. and his Kalon forgot that grab was. Yeah, I there you forgot. Go. It's, it's just that it's never as relevant as his move seven. Did I mention his move seven? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Yeah, the two for things me, it's that are least relevant. It's firm that I'm buying him for. Yeah. It's his guard that I wish to get. <laughs> yes, I, I buy him because of guard stand firm and block. And then, yeah, the move seven is sometimes relevant and the grab is sometimes relevant. Oh, and I have noticed that by right Rick. There. Rick always does remember the grab of City Billy. So, yeah, good good play by Rick. And popped the two pluses. Uh, plus uh, the sideline cage is safe. Three oh, plus. Well, oh, uh, fails the load of three plus. Uh... Yeah, no, it was just wow, a dodge. Wow, wow, wasn't, uh, wasn't the loner, it was just a, a failed dodge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Well, well, it doesn't matter, does it on skinks? That's why no. this that's why this is a good reading. Yeah. Now look, just think, if he if he dodged these guys off last turn, he'd have players mm -hmm. up here and this guy could get mm -hmm. surfed easily. Whereas now he can't get surfed easily. I mean he is gonna get two dice and probably powered, but he would have been easily surfed, uh, you know, with like what's it called, filling all the squares and everything. He could have easily yep. surfed him. But, uh, yeah, two up ahead, two with the side, and then the witch, as we said, blitzes. And it, it's uh, if the first one doesn't get it, the second one serves it. Mm -hmm. Hello, tackle. But this is a 75% hit, Jim. yes, because the wrestle as well. Yeah, boom. So it's a one in 16 if you're prepared mm -hmm. to re roll it, which you definitely uh, are. <laughs> and, oh, yeah. Tempest Soul rather thoughtfully has brought uh, more than two re rolls. So mm -hmm. a turn where that would have paid off if needed. Gets the AV break. I'm not blaming Rick. He got these in by you know, an incredibly lean, tight, aggressive run that got him in a great position. So that's why it has low rerolls. Yeah, that's uh, that's pretty great. Uh, scatter as well, just a three plus. Um, and yet, yeah. it's oh, probably about as good as uh, oh, no, as, 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 good as Rick, Rick could have got. As yeah, well. yeah, that was as, yeah. as good as Rick could have hoped for. Yeah. I mean, the only better square is probably the one on the sideline. But mm -hmm. even then, you know, misfield it goes out, and then Rick's still screwed. Yeah. However, Rick is still screwed. Silly Billy can't knock two elves over and pick the ball up in the same turn. That's not a thing. No, but he can just roll a bun whole bunch of dice, can't he? Just all the, yes. well, all the sixes. Rick can, Rick can always do that, but yeah. I mean, it's gonna be you're gonna have to power on two dice because if I'm I'm putting the witch already in front of that ball and then picking it up, so I'm not risking a dodge fail. So even if I don't get the pick up, I've got two elves on Silly Billy, both of which are sidestep giving him a one die and the ball is somewhere it doesn't matter where that uh, does not seem to be the plan no he just wants to punch well there's some things we can hit first because obviously you know banging is the most important <laughs> thing that yeah I think I think uh, this is yeah, a time yeah, when yeah. you can not bang as much so here we go for the pickup is he gonna stay there he's gotta reroll it I think I think so yeah Yep, just and he's the dodge off, I'm assuming. Yeah. 
You're just so likely to win here, aren't you? That's the thing. Yeah. You put the reroll in, get it, and then get it down to somebody. Also, you can punch this guy, can he? Three, four, five, six, five. Well, he's yeah. got one more square of yeah. movement. He hasn't used his dodge. Yeah, just dodge, dodge off. off. Yeah, so you got to dodge off. Yeah. I guess you're thinking if he wants to dodge here or here. If he dodges here, then there's a, it's a six plus dodge instead of a five plus. He probably just dodge. If he's, yeah, is he not doing it? He's not there, dodging. Yeah. Nope. Wow. Wow. And with sidestep, I mean, you're right. It's, it's one directly off forwards, isn't it? Yeah. Because with sidestep, it doesn't matter if you're that near the edge. But yeah. why give him the. Oh, I don't. The one time, I don't know. Because if you blitz, it's a it's a six like plus a, to get the six, ball six, down, six, and then a five, five plus to dodge yep. off. Yeah, so exactly. it's a thirty percent to get him down, right? If he puts in a reroll, yep. whereas if he dodges, yep. he's a one in thirty six to fail. I guess if he one in thirty six fails, then uh, potentially silly Billy could just dodge off, pick it up, and score. So it, it, it's actually it harder. Off, in fact. He can blitz off. In well, he can't one really in blitz off. To get off. Um, I would he's get off because he's got because he's got grab. Oh yeah, he's got grab. Yeah. yeah. Fuck me, God! I yeah. literally it's just how to use the turn before and I already <laughs> forgot. Yeah. Fucking yeah. hell. No, I would definitely have dodged off. Um, also, because as an elf coach, one of the things that matters to me, I, I don't tend to care for my elves that much. But the witches, I find I do a little bit because of the low armor. Mm -hmm. um, so I would rather not take the hit, but... It's probably okay, isn't it? It's a one it's, die on a blood It is probably okay. Oh, yeah, I think, it was definitely I think it was definitely correct to dodge. And, and yeah. the fact that you could dodge directly behind to keep it a six plus dodge for Silly Billy, when he's just obviously going for this hit, like... Mm -hmm. You just yeah, I think you have to dodge. And then also, if he powers you, you can sidestep back here as well. So like, it was fantastic. Uh, oh no, he couldn't sidestep because he's got grab. Yep. Yep. One so he, yeah, yeah. One day I remember Silly Billy has grab. If he if he got the six there, then he would have been able to you know then it would have been great. But yeah. I wonder what Rick's keeping that last reroll for. Yeah. Well, he's not having to spend it on the loner either though. PC is he? I think he needs that too. If not, how do you? How, what's the use is it this half? Yeah. I mean, how how are you going to stop the elves coming back? Maybe it's turn six, right? Yeah. I mean, Rick must feel he's going to do a Saurus dodge to stop the elves driving back mm -hmm. and turning over for one nil. Yeah. Yeah, but that's the only he's thing still going to have to power Bludger, isn't he? He's still going to have to power Bludger after he does. Yeah. Yeah. So this yeah. was still probably the best chance. As as, as terrible as this was, a four yes, plus it six was a plus terrible shot. four plus six plus to then do a five plus five plus. Yeah, but it looks yeah. like it was his last chance for the half, doesn't it? It really looks like it was his last chance for the half. I don't know. I don't. I don't hate not rerolling it. I don't hate not rerolling it, but I, I just think he's not going to get a better chance this but, half. Caleb, okay. I've seen this film. The elf dodges off, hands it to another elf that runs, <laughs> throws it to another elf, and that one goes and scores. Well, yeah, except he's going to punch it. Oh, of course, he's going to punch it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> After he does some other punches as well. Obviously. Yeah, let's do an irrelevant punch first. Mm -hmm. That's that's kind of like that. contact so that you can get more one Ds later on. There's a blockless two die there. We could do that. Would be fun. Wow. Wow. I think the only debate is uh, whether he takes the two D with this or does he uh, blitz off and hit the skink. I mean, personally, I would take this dodge all day long and blitz the skink in the middle. Yeah. No, and then no. that's also Bl blitz, blitz with a witch elf. Blitz with a witch elf, isn't it? That's, yeah. that's the play. Blitz, blitz, blitz silly Billy with a sure. witch is the play. 100%. Okay. 100%. The witch that's already moved? No, the, no, the ball the, carrier. Uh, oh, the ball carrier. Okay. Yeah. Well, he gets him down anyway, so. Well, he gets him down, yeah, so it doesn't yeah. have to. But he's got two elves stuck at him on the wrong side of the pitch, which is, I suppose, might be good. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. But you can't get far enough away from the wrestle skink either, right? And that might be a much better use of your single dice reroll. Yes, the, yes, the witch elf. Uh, the, the, I the, felt the tackle to kind of protect yourself a little bit as well, right? I mean, this has been a super safe way of going about it, except that you're leaving yourself somewhere near that wrestle skink. Yes. But See, my blitz would have put the tackle on him, right? Yes. Yeah. The advantage of dodging off and blitzing the loner is you can bring the tackle back afterwards and put it on the skink. Yes. And then dodge off Silly Billy and hand it to that freed blitzer. I don't like yeah, dodging off Silly Billy. Takes it a long way away. I really hate dodging off Silly Billy. But yeah, I guess the other way is yeah, if you could if you could hand off and pass to somebody is pretty good. And then mm -hmm. you just get away from the wrestler, but then you want to be away from five plus Saurus dodges as well. So I, I like blitzing blitzing the ball carrier. To you We're know, cause you, the last thing you want to do is dodge a ball carrier like it's suicide, right? You're definitely going to want a thirty six. 
I've played enough Blood Bowl to know that I yeah. always win in 36 if I can. You, you would definitely win in 36, that. I yeah. See, I, I, really like I would fine. believe with me and Dark Elves and my Dark Elf luck in the last year, I wouldn't. Yeah, yeah same, same as that. If I would do so anything I, I could to not dodge with it. But I don't, I don't hate knocking Silly Billy down, but it, it does make this a uh, slightly more problematic uh, situation than it. Uh, and perhaps see, a one in thirty-six, one in thirty-six would have left it. Yeah, see, but if you do, if you do the blitz, uh, then you can move this edge five with all the tackle on him because now he's just he's just one. It's just you? a straight dice. He didn't. She didn't even come in soft. Well, hey, well, well, can, there's can, a four-two for two dice on her right now. You can dodge here and then get this guy up there and stuff. Okay. So yes, drop something There's else. There's the one source. in 36 oh, by the way. Oh, 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 like, just oh, quietly, yeah. just quietly. That's it what happens happen. if you try and dodge yeah. an elf. <laughs> well, and, and now it's just a four plus. That There's removes the two plus. So four plus for two die on her with the blockless saurus. No, you can play, Jim. Oh, I'm hitting with wrestle. Are oh, you hitting with wrestle? Yeah. Oh, the wrestle was going to be my fetch. Yeah, but I think I'm happy to go in at a draw. Yeah, I mean, you're probably right. Just a one Four. die with wrestle, but and no way to pick it up. I mean, there's the loner, isn't there? That could come pick it up. Mm. That's, that's helpful. Yeah. I wonder if there... Uh, do you know what? Oh, okay, I, I can't pause it. You, uh, my way <laughs> would have been do this hit, and then try to get the skink back. Right, one, two, three, yeah. four, five, double GFI, and then chain this guy forward, and then oh, uh, nice, blitz yeah. with the blitz with the Saurus. But one D wrestling is probably just as good, to be fair. Yeah, I'm just I'm standing slibly, and I guess you uh, try two dodges to make it two. I mean, D, you right? can, yeah, you can, you can one in nine, one in nine here for then mm -hmm. two die with the wrestle, but yeah. there's no fetch afterwards. Yeah, that's probably better, isn't it? Just double. Dodge. I think it's going to double GFI here, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, double G five with him. Yeah, and that puts the assist in two. Yeah. Oh yeah, this, yeah, this is yeah. the best. Yeah, Jesus Christ, I'm done. Wow, I'm and then you still really got the loader to fetch. Now we all should have seen that. That's... I'm not, I'm not Ooh. playing today, but boy, how did oh, I play wow. badly today? <laughs> Gets the pow, yeah. Full on pow. Yeah, That's I would have sized up well, here. Nice play from Rick, and yeah. it's put him back in his own he's drive. Left. He's got one square left, two. He's got three. He's, he's got, got jump three. up. Oh. He's got jump up because he he's had he had, up, he had the audacity up, yeah. to believe that he would get knocked over and not killed, and it and it happened somehow. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I mean. We, we can joke about that, Jim, and it is funny, but Rick does play to his outs. He mm -hmm. he knows what he likes to do and how he likes to coach, and he puts silly skills on that work because he knows how to use them the way he wants them used. Yeah. This guy should still 10 years ago. Yeah, and yep. silly, yeah, silly Billy should be on his feet by now. The only yes. thing that's forgivable is the loner skink, who you might want to do all sorts of silly oh, dodges. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is fun. Silly Billy isn't dodging. He should be on his feet. Because this is tricky now, because uh, he has to make up his mind of where he wants to go with this, including some GFIs before he activates Silly Billy, and he can't mm. afford to put the reroll in this turn, I don't believe, because he still has the opportunity of scoring next turn. However, we're not criticizing Rick. It's been a great turn. I get that he was doing all the other important stuff, and his mind whirring at a zillion miles an hour, and that's yeah. why Silly Billy hasn't stood. Yeah. But he should stand there. Yeah, yeah, it's it's co it's correct that he should have stood up earlier. Like that's all, isn't yeah. it? For yeah. the people watching at home. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And if not, people are going, oh, they didn't even say Silly Billy should have stood up. Yeah. Yes, he should have done. But, I mean, also, it is possible Rick does plan to dodge him because it's Rick. <laughs> I don't so, think so. Let's not overrule no. that. No, I, I think, think this is. guy maybe just stands up. I think, honestly, I think you just stand up with, with the skink. Uh, I think he's going to 3 plus 3 plus that guy out, and I think he's going to dodge off at Silly Billy. No, you yeah, can't I think dodge he is. off at Silly yeah. Billy. Yeah. I think he's going to, too. Well, the fun thing is that he can actually move four squares when he stands up, because... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's like, not jumped yeah, up, to so be he fair, can't move as much as the skin did. It's no. so, yeah, to be fair, on a five plus, it's so good to have him there, isn't yeah, it? So, yeah, maybe, yeah, maybe it is worth doing it, yeah. Or even there, right? You could even... Yeah. Because he's moved seven, you could maybe. put him here. Maybe yeah, he it could. is worth it. Maybe it is genuinely worth going for it, yeah. So, I think yep. Rick's just thinking about oh, turn order. Does he do the skink first or does he do Clever Rick? Silly Clever Rick. First. It's there we are. And then he can do the three plus and the three plus. Oh, oh Rick. Oh, does he leave him there maybe? No, he can't. No, no one more. Can't. Yeah, he can get yeah, it. He well, he could have gone yeah. here, couldn't he? Yeah, that would have been. Oh, he's going to foul as well. Oh, foul. <laughs> oh, oh my god, god. Rick is too good. <laughs> Oh, Rick is man. too good. Is I feel like Rick Rollins. Not the game. 
<laughs> oh my god. Rick is too good. Woo! You like Flip Rick rolling, me. Rick rolling. He really gets me in the mood. Flip Lads. me. I mean, hilariously, it's still just a three plus in to hit him with tackle, but it is uphill. He is uh, a dice rolling. Well, dude. not necessarily right. He can he can put an assist in, pow him, and then he's oh, yeah, got sure, yeah. the, and then he could uh, even think about dodging in there on a four plus and then serving yeah. the ball carrier. Yeah, fair play. But um, oh. hello, Dimmy. Hello. Yeah. hello. Dimmy's wanted it. I, wow. I would definitely serve the ball here. You're out of the foxhole, Dimmy. I am, I am. I've popped out just to see this. Wow. Buddy, wow. so great to hear from you, man. How are you? Uh, well, mate, well. I uh, just, I heard your excitement on stream and I was like, holy moly. Yay. Holy moly. This is unfortunately extremely easy to do, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is especially with the edgy five. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Private yeah, use, stim use, use the lovely loader. You push it onto the side behind the skink. And then the one pushing it is the other bit behind. You then got it in very easy. Just step in next to Silly Billy. And you just need to come in the front with the AG5 or your, and you're done. So he wants to get the guard in first, though. So he's going to have to do a dodge GFI to get he him in. He could do it. He could just use this guy. He's, he's got multiple options. Yeah, he's power. got enough pieces. The, the thing is, if, if you if you come path? in here, oh. if you come in here, then that gives you the instant 2D on the ball. Um, sure. Or, no wonder, yeah, no, no, yeah, oh, no, yeah. yeah, it's not easy, is it? It's not, it's not that easy. No. It's not as no, easy I mean, as I think, think. I think you do have, probably have to use the guard and bring it around on the 2 plus dodge and 2 plus GFI. Yeah. Because that gives you the skink push to where you want. Yeah. That gives uh, you the skink into there and then you still have the other the two guys to fill by, in the gap. Yeah, and you easy route in the front. Yeah. By Silly Billy and then you go in the front. You could also just punch Silly Billy, right? Mm. That's not Yeah. True. I mean, well. he's got block, you need two assists to do it, and to cancel the skink. Yep, but I mean, so, Tempest so. Soul likes punching things. <laughs> he does, we have no. noticed that, yes. Yeah. <laughs> it, it has come up. I mean, the fact the skink has wrestle is also a problem. Mm-hmm. Oh, we don't, I don't know that we love this. That's the wrong square, yeah. It is. It blocks his route in to, it, to cancel to the other Billy. square. Yeah, yeah to be exactly. between Silly Billy and where this elf could end up. Yeah, that's that's why the, 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 the guard was more desirable, the wasn't it? Yeah, the exactly. guard was more desirable, but it did need a 2 plus without a skill reroll to get there. So. Yes, it did. Ah, okay, so we're not doing the surf. Oh, um, you're, you're ahead of us again. You're ahead of us again. Ah, <laughs> uh, sorry. It's okay. <laughs> He could have so, dodged through the Saurus tackle zone with really the skill reroll rather yes. than through the GFI. So it's, 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 it's both, isn't it? Is he, he's, he's only is this moved broken? Six, is this replay broken? Oh, is he moved past, is he? No, no, he's only moved six. Oh, you're saying to do the 3 3 3? The replay's broken. Okay, brilliant. Okay. Cool. Oh, is that a lino? Is that, is that a no, yeah, the replay's broken. Oh. Yeah, exactly. oh, fuck me. I broke it, sorry guys. I'll I'll leave. I'll <laughs> leave. <laughs> I'm to have you here. Broke it. Looking at Rick's stream, I can see that the replay is broken. And obviously, we're uh, out of time. Oh, 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 oh. Really Mine funny. isn't broken. PC's ahead of us, so he's yeah. like, oh, well. PC was ahead, ahead of us because his replay wasn't, like, his viewer wasn't broken. Uh -huh. That was the problem. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Cool. Nothing's happening. There's nothing, nothing happening. needed to be talked about. It's really, really boring. Yep. Right, here we go. So he's not going for the surf. <laughs> and he gets the wand. He gets the power. Oh my god. Wow. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, good Ooh, oh my in the god. pickup. And is he dodging out as well? No, he's just going to sandwich. But okay. And then he's got his scoring threat. He's got his scoring threat. Okay. Well, fair play. So you see why I'd have got it away from Rick with my dodges that turn I talked about it, Jim? <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. Turns out you need to get away from Rick because he keeps coming at you. Well, and you could have just—you mean you could have done—you could have made that turn a lot better. And also the previous yeah. turns, right? If you'd got away from these guys earlier, you'd have had so much more to react, and then he could have shut it down much better. And like, there's lots of yep. things you could have done differently. And the fails I was risking were ruinous if they went wrong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, all, all true. There's always an upside and a downside, yeah. and hence most of it. When we sound secure and safe, and we think it's what we think, it's because it's what we think. Oh, oh, baby! And yeah, and to be fair, he did he did fail the first dodge. He did that turn, and then if so, if he dodged with a ball carry, he would have just. Oh wow, that's a just... weird square to go to because he's allowing the other guy, the rookie to, to pick catch it up, it. and he's oh, he nearly yeah, got it. That's what he's yeah, waiting. I thought we'd oh. gone there. I thought we'd gone there. 
Oh, oh that's unfortunate. <sighs> well, we've got well, a punch here and then a pick yep, up and a handoff. And hand then a off. pick up and a handoff. If yeah. that five plus had worked, it was just yep. zoom up past the witch, wasn't it? Yeah. In fact, no, because Slippy could have tried to smash yeah, it punch down. Yeah, punch it because of grab. He, he would have. Yeah, he would have. Grab, oh, I know that. Him. Yeah, because it, 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 it cancelled the assist. Yeah, he had a one die to glue, and then exactly one, two, three. Oh, this is still on. Like yeah, that it was, it was in range as well. On. If that five plus had worked, it was just the dodge yeah. off. He was in range. Yeah, he just needs a five plus pickup. Exactly. Yep. We'll take this hit on the five line three. Up. A score yeah. basically. Five three two. Get rid of him. You need to move the line out first. Yeah, and then take the hit with and not follow up, obviously. Yeah, five three two. Yeah, two 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 D blocks with block. And uh, rather sensibly, despite Boom. the recklessness of Rick, ah, oh. he's, he's got his reroll. He's got his reroll that he's uh, got his reroll. Oh, still. gets the full power. Gets the full power on the witch. Oh, oh, oh baby, has the discourtesy not to die. Yeah. Okay, so just a five three. Five three two. Five three two. Uh, five three two. Yeah. But low yeah, on there's... the three two. Oh, yeah, come on, baby, on come on. Two. Let's see them rig dice. We've seen how the list goes. Did we have, yeah. He's got the pick up! Oh, my God! Come on, get the three. Oh, baby. Come on, Rick. He's got the three! He's got it! Just a two. With no reroll. Oh, God. Single GFI. Oh, my God. oh baby! Is there oh, a triple? No, there is not. Amazing. Say, perfect day turn stall, <laughs> says Squirrel in the chat. Oh my god. Absolutely. The bearded man with the reckless plan. That's oh the moment. It, it's just so Rick, isn't it? It's Some days we all feel like Rick rolling. Does, does Rick oh, have a beard? Uh, <laughs> Sometimes. Not, rid of, not at, the moment. at the moment, yeah. 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 Which is why the song I was writing, I haven't finished. <laughs> that, 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 is... that rhyme was so important to it. Um, <laughs> god. Well, and I, I think the, uh, the dodge from uh, Silly Billy, Silly Billy the highlight yeah. of all of that from me. <laughs> it's slippery in range, I only just saw that now. I mean, in many ways, it's the beauty, beauty of, of what happened there, is that none of that was wrong. No, it was the play. The play it was the, play. the right plays, because it was yep. the only plays that got it done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But also, am I alone in thinking it's only Rick that could have got those plays <laughs> done? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's something about like so. This Jimmy thing, won't I mean. risk a one in thirty-six dodge, let alone a five plus. <laughs> so. No, I mean I would have done that play that turn one now. Of but course, uh, course you would. Yeah. It was the play. The play also, was the I play. wouldn't have let Rick have the chances he had in that match. <laughs> so you know, there's a bit of a there's Temper Soul's got a bit of a he's he's let it slip a little bit, right? Like the look, the overhitting had some benefits. He he took the Crocs out. He was keeping all those Sauruses hemmed in at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, it, it developed a lot of the chances he got through the, the amount of hitting he did. I think we all feel he stayed a turn too long with a couple too many L's. Yeah. And then when it all went wrong, he just he undercapitalized, didn't he? Mm. Yeah, yeah. He really did, yeah. Yeah, it was that hit on Silly Billy, right, with a tackler, and so then he had, didn't have yep. tackle on the on this on the edge three, yeah. and, the, and then even slow. even going on the inside instead of going into the middle where he had cover. I mean, sure, would be. Yeah. yeah, we're being very harsh in, in not and him not anticipating Rick dice. Mm, yeah. Well, the strength I mean, three skink being jump up means I'd yeah. have wanted that ball away from it. A hundred percent. And you had it's to have just, tackle on, like you had to get tackle on him, and you had to get away from him. You know? In fact, but you, yeah, you, so you either want to, uh, yeah, you want to tackle on him, and you, then you either want to move the ball as far like out of his range, or mm -hmm. um, yeah, either ball out of his range or tackle on him. Yeah, one, one of those yeah. two, and he he did neither, which was. You know, suicidal, but yes, yeah, so he did, well, he did open from... the door for Rick to roll great dice. Yes, and yes, he, still he great play and still great Rick play and dice. To Rick. Roll them. Yep. Rick did roll the great dice, yes. Yep. He rolled all the dice. <laughs> he did roll <laughs> all the dice, all of them. <laughs> there were a lot of them, and he rolled all of them, and they all came right for him, Jim. That's what that expression means. <laughs> yep. So Tempest Hall can feel aggrieved. He was definitely unlucky not to get the stop, let alone the turnover. Yeah. But he could have done a little more to secure it. He I concur. Done. Yep. This is a pretty straightforward uh, one turn if he wants it because of all of the sidestep and what have you. It yeah. uh, looks like he's set up to just do that exactly. Not get any of the frenzy hits in there unless he wants to put them in now. But I think... Uh, he wants the, well, you want the last hit to be the frenzy hit, right? You do, yep. Yeah. Which is... Uh, no, it looks like he's going for the second hit to be the frenzy. 
No, no, this can be the last one. It's on yeah, the, it's yeah. On the last one. Oh, okay, yep, yeah, cool, fair enough. I, um, I don't think this is the way I would have done it. No. No. No, but it, it doesn't really matter, does it? You also want to be able to hit the crocs if you get a power on the first hit, so like... So I would have yep. put the witch elf like here or here, yeah. but it's probably better than here. Yes. Um, and you definitely want this guy here so that you can hit him. Um, if you power, you can size up to there and then hit him again to get that one. And then, you know, hit him on the last one. So yeah, so the witch elf here. The witch elf here. Hmm. And... It's better for the quick snap though. Something. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't know, I, I, want, to, I want to be able to power on the first hit. Yeah, fair enough. I yep. agree. And, and, then, and then be able to... It is a complex web, Jim, as we discussed a little bit earlier, I think. Yeah, um, maybe, maybe, I you can't the afford, maybe you can't afford to power on the first hit, just the fact you need so many pushes. Yeah, right? two, yeah. And it's strength five, one is harder to get the pushes with. And here you don't have that dilemma of their, their hits with claws, so perhaps I can settle for the attrition if I'm not getting the, you know, the one-term ones I want. But you should yeah, definitely have the witch here. The I'm, sure, I'm sure the witch is here, and I hate not having yeah. anything for the chance of hitting the box. Well, all the guys in the second line are uh, rookie linemen as well, so... It looks it like he's setting up to just easy. get extra hits. It's four pushes for it. Yeah, so yeah. You, you hit the first yeah. one to there, and then you hit the second one to there, and then the, the witch alters the next two. Ah, uh, okay. okay. That's a lot. Yeah, that's all right. It's all right as it is. It probably yeah, that's all right. It probably works how it is, but um, I'm sure it's not I'd optimized. I'd also do the pass now. Yeah. Yeah, because he's at five, yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a two plus catch and it's easily annoying. And because I'd also rather have failed this than <laughs> fail something later. I mean, the, yeah, there's, there's, no, there's, no, there's no issue when he's at five, yeah. right? You obviously do exactly. when he's in, when yep. he's in the tackle zone. Mm -hmm. It only becomes a question if he's at four. Yes, but if you push him any further away, it might be a. A three plus throw instead of a two plus. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's the thing. It's only an issue if he's at four, right? Because he's yeah. got a three plus catch. But if he's at five, you're. You know what? I I like the one turn defense with Sibley and the Croxagor, rather than the back line. So he has to mm -hmm. he has to follow you. Yeah. Because yeah. it's down firm and you got shrimp five guard on one side and then he has to push to either the Croxagor or the Saurus. So I, I don't think this is the best. One yeah, no, that's a good point. We should have Slibby up there. Yeah, it's a terrible, it's a terrible one turn defense, really. <laughs> it's, it's, I say it's this is. I say this. I say this is a gaping <laughs> hole defender myself. Yeah, this is this is uh, like an edge yeah. five is, and and he, he gets a three day sim here. Yeah, so he goes mm -hmm. there. Yeah, and then he can he can move these guys around to fill in this one, and then uh, the. Side step on the two. left comes over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah he, he can, he can fill one. Yeah, it's, I mean, that's... he can fill one, and he can fill the last one probably. So is he dodging with the dodge guy? Yeah, that one's yeah, nice. He's got, he's got risk. He has to. Yeah. Just needs two more in place, and one of them does need to dodge. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He does have to do a dodge. I um, yeah, I definitely think Silly Billy should have been on the other. Only one. It's and one. It's thirty-six. And then he just needs the witch to not pow on the first Ooh. hit. He could That's have he could have been like real big balls and gone Croxagor, Sibley and Sidestep Skink. I think if he'd moved those to the other squares, he only needed to do one dodge. But it's a tiny thing. No. It's still a lovely shape. No, he still had to do a dodge. He started to do a dodge or a GFI. He just he just could have set up better to to have done. But yeah, yeah I, I don't I don't think this is the correct. Yeah, you're right. Okay, scout. so the dodge makes sense because it has inbuilt reroll cover. Yep. Right, so he is he's pushed himself in range. Yep, just mm -hmm. a few dodges and he's got it. Two plus. The... Is it four two pluses? <laughs> yeah. Elliot of a moment. Yeah. Oh, and that extra oh, push oh, that he oh, oh, oh that extra dodge. Oh, he gets it anyway. Yeah. Outrageous. Okay. Yeah, Mordred, wow. I was thinking, Dimmy, Dimmy, I was thinking I'm gonna, I was gonna go into, into double double A2K19 and make, make Dimmy an army man. <laughs> Doing a salute. <laughs> Honestly, guys, if you're not playing Fox Up, what are you doing with your life? <laughs> well, that's, that's, that's a bit sad for Rick, isn't it? After, after all that play and like effort to get that touchdown, it just, you know. Yeah. I, I think I uh, think you should have done an actual one turn defense rather than back line against AG5. Yeah. yeah. But That's also definitely. he uh would probably have expected to be uh one all at the drive. 
considering the team and how a one nil down. I mean, he, he looked like he was going to be one nil down. It looked to all the world sure, like he was going to be one nil down. So it's it's still prior good, but game, it's still going to not be one nil up right after getting I, I, the one nil. I agree, but prior to the game, I mean, he would have been like, well, it'll be drawn at halftime, and then it'll. Depend. I wouldn't well, think that. To be all, fair, no. I, I I did stop in and watch a bit of Rick versus PC, and I'd written Rick off on like turn twelve. Yeah, mm -hmm. me too. Uh, and then all of a yeah, sudden, me too. <laughs> some, some, some shenanigans happened and the man yeah. with the legends blood bowl jesus um, yeah, rose again didn't he so, yeah, you know. he did indeed yeah well it's, it's, there was the failed armor break on the potato and the, the <coughs> failed, failed yep. gfi and then two ones and then, out of three yeah. and that'll do it yeah that will do it yeah i Even should if it's have a 17 year old that you're playing against i should have <laughs> somehow had something in that midfield area knowing that he would have to cut in there with mm. the side squeeze, but I needed the side squeeze to be that tight. I, I was one dwarf short at the key moment, as you so often are. He's yep. been really protective of Silly Billy. Like, I'm wondering if he's got a plan for him. Mm. Mm. Well, he's the, you know, his dodge strength, strong guard, long moving hero, isn't he? <laughs> he yes. also, I think he wants to use him for the grab on the He's got grab. Yeah, he's got yeah, grab. Yeah, yeah, but then, like, it's tough, isn't it? It's tough. It's basically like Griff if he dodges every time. Yeah. So, so Rick's yeah. on ten. What yeah, so he's, got he's got guard. I'm surprised he doesn't put him central. All right, he could just put he could just put him here and then put yeah. Super Skink in the middle and just keep him central. Yeah. Um, well, and I mean, Skuro, Skuro, in now. my defence, Skuro, when 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 Silly Billy had his one last shot at the ball, I expected Tempestal to play competently and not let Rick in for another <laughs> chance. <laughs> um, if I'm Tempest here. I'm hitting Super Skink. Yep. Yes, I'm bringing yeah. the guard around first. One, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five, six, which is no GFIs. Two, three, oh, he's going to dagger. No, it's one GFI or he a dodge. Dagger, yeah. And then I'm throwing my tackle onto the Super Skink, which is again a single dodge. So it's two one in 36 is to get a two die on Super Skink with your tackle piece. Mm -hmm. I, I, don't like I would do that. I don't know. But instead, we're putting the Agility 5 on the Crocs. Uh, yeah, which is great. I have no great, idea great why. Because you can dodge away on a 2. Dodge away on a 2. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I just thought mm. I'd let you say it. Great. Oh, oh very good. Post, daka, daka. Here I go again. Oh, you can't press that. Oh, my oh. God. <laughs> but luckily, he's set up for a daka, so it's all right. Yeah. I was about to say, Rick is... lost his, his most... Oh, look where the ball is. Oh, my well, God. Hilariously, he's, he's actually likely to catch it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Imagine if he'd set up to blitz the the, the, uh, the strength three. He'd have put two players like here on the line, and he would have got he, the blitz would have been devastating. So there you go. <laughs> it's inaccurate, so he would catch it on two, and in three tackle zones, that raises it to a five. Well, mate, the skink could go in and just wrestle him. Huh? Not sure he's going to catch it, but he, it's about one in three. Oh, rolling a five. The skink <laughs> can go in and just wrestle him, and then you just hope it's not a three and five. And then hope, it, hope it lands on the crux. So uh, like yeah. on yeah. the... Well, then it's a touchback. So well, you, you don't yeah. want it on the crux. You want it inside. But yeah. So, yeah I mean, hope. to be fair, I, don't, I, I think yeah, it's a bit well, rubbish. I mean, Rick lost his key skink on the very first action of the game. Was in trouble without his drive. Had to do all sorts of dodges and Rick dices to get there. Got there. Then suffered a one turn. And while my heart was breaking for him after an excellently coached half from Rick, given the positions he was in. Part of me was thinking, I'm him. looking forward to how Rick solves this. <laughs> and here we go. He's this is how it starts. He's got to reroll. Oh, he doesn't. No, he can't reroll. that, can he? He's only got two. No, just yeah, push now he's got to dodge your tackle. He should sidestep back and left. Yes. 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 Yep. Correct. And the skink just goes into the square what? and hopes to fail the catch, and it lands either side of him. Yeah, I hate that. I hate I that. I don't like that. Sure oh, I, yeah, really I wouldn't be like there. Well, no, you don't want to try to catch it. It's oh, not so. worth the risk. Yeah, I would have. I would have dodged back out. <laughs> yeah, I would have been. Yeah. I would have been full. Yeah, one, okay. one is he trying to contend with a side The two there. places he, he doesn't want away. the ball are oh, either yeah. side of where the skink is now. Has he stepped there to stop one of those being somewhere where the ball is going to end up? No, oh, yeah, and maybe if it is, fair, yeah, because yeah, if it lands on that elf, either he catches it and can still dodge away on a two, as we said, or it bounces off into somewhere safer or. To a touchback. Yeah, so now there's only this as a bad There's only square. one dangerous square, yeah, isn't there? Yeah, that's yeah, the that's only fair. reason I can think but of. But then to be fair, it's, it's like... the same if he goes here, right? 
It's the same if yeah. it goes here, then these, yeah. these squares aren't... No, no, I guess there's two... But then you'd have to bounce back and back there, so there's still only be one bad square if you'd sidestep there. So maybe that's so what I he's thinking. I think he's trying to remove a bad square. Yeah, that's I think that was his thinking. Guess. Yeah. yeah, I think that was his thinking. I think the other right thing is, he's going to have to, so he's gonna have to hit the kink with a tackle, and if he gets wrestled, he's getting fouled, so that's uh, interesting. Yeah, and he can't hit him now. He's got two guards in, right? So now it's really hard to hit the skink with. Like That was why this sidestep was so much better, yeah, because you've just got an instant 2D. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, this is really hard to hit this king now with attack. I mean, you could blitz him, but then if you blitz him, what if you don't power him? So, I think he dodges out and blitzes him. I think that's what I would do. That's what you kind of have to do, right? But it's, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. it's going to be interesting to see where then the he probably goes. Si he probably sidesteps back to sit. That's if he catches it as well. Yeah, this, oh, it's lads. a six to catch it. It's a uh, lad, it's all right. I mean, six is happening, especially when you're no! oh, They do oh, have to ring. Going? Oh, they they are, it is a touch uh, Yeah. So, okay. And it did land in the square he sidestepped into. The sidestep was genius. Yep. Instead of falling there in four tackle zones, it's a touchback. <laughs> yeah, what a genius. Oh, wow. Man, he's so um, good. Yeah, this is fun. Just, why not give it to the, one of the blotchers? Oh, because he wanted a dark anyway. Yeah, he it's wants got a, yeah. It's got it on yeah, the yeah, 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 but I could have just missed it. I mean, he could have misclicked and it would have landed on the blotcher. This is better than having it. There's just so many of them. Daka Daka. <laughs> Daka Daka, here we go. He probably closed his eyes, rolled his mouse around the screen a couple of times, and then clicked. <laughs> and was like, oh, it's on a bludger. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I guess you go for the. Oh, no, it's a 3 plus dodge for the uh, for the Edge 5. It is now, yeah. Mm hmm. So probably you prioritize other things first. Yeah, maybe, maybe Side step, it's only one here it'll have to take. Yeah, you punch this And of course, one. none of them have tackled. It would be 3 die, but. I was still hitting right. Super Skink, I think. Yeah, 3D I'm him. Good. Yeah, 3D this skink. So that yeah, then you can clear out. the way out, don't you? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I like that. And you're 3 d a skink as well, which is nice, isn't it? Well, it's I'd not a full Dacker, Jim. I know it's a Look, it's, He's I'd quite surprisingly for Tempest Soul. He's taking a hit time. rather than a full Dacker. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, it was to get this guy out. That's, that's totally fair. I would have made that hit too, to get out of the H5. Yes. And um, it does give him a hit on the other, the yeah. super skink. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is what. Yeah. And he KOs him. Of course, I wouldn't have had to have done that because I would have sidestepped there. But then on the other hand, then the ball would have been in three tackle zones, which would have sucked, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. So it mm -hmm. just does have goes. to be in the third round of challenge, Jim, and that's not like. Ooh! Oh! Oh, PC. He's not. He's not. Because you don't like playing like Blood Bowl. Oh, PC. Ouch. Oh man, where's your team, by the way, uh, PC? In this, I lost in the second round of challenge. Wow, Jim! Okay. Okay. Wow, Jim! <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I did take a notable scalp on the way there, but yes, I lost to Rick Reckless in round two. Scalp? <laughs> did yeah, you? you beat... Who? Beat, beat Jim. Yeah. Oh, all right. Okay. So yeah. was that a ball joke? Was it? Ooh. <laughs> what? Because <laughs> it was a scalp, you see. You can't do that for us. Okay, well. I know you want to, but you can't. Jim's very conscious I mean, about it. No, you've got, a, you've got an edge five. Oh, ball joke. I thought he said ball. Pass. I thought he said ball, not ball. I was like, what's it, it going to do with balls? Like, he's what, shaving my balls. I couldn't understand yeah. it at all. Balls. No, it's just scalp. It yeah, no, bald. Bald is yeah. what is what. Yeah. I, I thought he said ball. And I thought, what, what, what has scalp got to do with balls? Hey, I'm the one talking yeah. English here, Jimmy. Yeah, well, I thought, like, what do you mean, tick? Like, do you mean tickets or what? And I was like, like, football and tickets with scalping. I was like, I was completely bamboozled. I'm going to put I will shave Jimmy's balls on my reward list. Oh, brilliant. Thanks. For anyone that couldn't put 2,000 chest hairs in. <laughs> None of us are shaving our balls for this. 2,000? <laughs> I think I have 2,000. I know. I'm going to make it cheap. <laughs> <laughs> That's only about three hours of viewing. Kalon, Kalon shaves his balls before he masturbates on his hero clicks in a dark <laughs> room. No, I shave with my hero clicks looking at me. <laughs> it's part of the process. Yeah. Well, I call one of them Kfo and he judges me. <laughs> oh, God. I, I think this is a pretty bad matchup for Lizards. I don't know how you guys... Yes, it's, it's terrible. Terrific. It's yeah. only the fact that it's Rick and he's rolled all the dice and it's worked brilliantly. <laughs> yeah, oh, he like... should have been smashed out long before now. This should be a hundred times over. Yeah. yeah. 
But Rick has saved it every time. I mean, with incredibly good moves that have also yeah. um, found all the dice. Yeah, superb decisions. Does anyone check Cabal TV for what the result between Elliot and Rick was? Because that's normally a oh, good yeah. indication ah. of who, who actually wins the game. <laughs> Clever. Would you would you say, Jim, that, um, that Rick's rolled all the dice in this game? <laughs> no. That's you'd be comfortable Ooh. with. Well, He's no, rolled some no, of them. Yeah. Yeah, he shouldn't have wins. rolled that one. shouldn't have rolled that, no. Wouldn't have rolled that, I tell you. It's uh, <laughs> a bad decision to roll a one there. It's kind of tempting I, to go up the side here, isn't it? Yeah, I think that's the that's enough of an opening, to be honest. But it is. Then, I, I mean, how much I more does he need? He's got a ridiculously overpowered Dark Elf team that can just stand there and still I, can't get knocked over by the lizards. So I think it's too early. I think he wants to get into a fight, to be honest. He does wow. love blocking things. He Massive. does seem to like a bit of a fight, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. mm. But just it just like having a, having a Saurus down here and having these over here it is really nice, really nice it to is. go over here. But then yep. you know he could just stall another turn, like it's fine. Just would, would you would, would you almost say he's a greedy banger? Cause <laughs> hey. I, I don't I don't want to say it, but you know <laughs> again, <laughs> an elephant in the room and all. <laughs> You're not that fat, Jimmy. Oh, wow! <laughs> <laughs> You're not that ball, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> they they both so are. Oh, yeah, God. God. that trunk's that big old. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the funny thing is though, his PC is fatter than me, and Kalon's balder than Jimmy. <laughs> well, I'm also fatter than all of you as well. I'm definitely the. If there's a competition on the fattest, baldest man, it's definitely me. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm thinking of any right now. <laughs> Give me a few days. I'll get back. Yeah, he's gonna bang and sit back. I, I think yep. it's too early for him to do anything. Turn yeah, thirteen is, is yeah. turn thirteen is when I start pretending to. Is he gonna fail that? Nah, no, it's just ten. No, it's just, it's... It is just that chance to isolate. There's a skink on the ground. There's a saurus you can isolate. Nah, can, can stay strong, Daka. He's got plenty of time. Yeah, I think you foul when you're behind, not when you're ahead. Like oh, for sure, but I've seen him really. soul play, and he likes to do it. And I don't know why you're you're holding up that guy with the yeah, actual player, guy, best yeah. player yeah. of your line. Yeah, 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 yeah I definitely have line. Your skink slaughterer, as well yeah. as your ag agile piece. It's yeah. yeah, it's his only tackle, right? It is. It's a not brilliant choice. Mm-hmm. I mean, even if he wins, if he loses that AG5, it's going to feel like a loss. Exactly. But even yeah. if he plans to foul it with the only terrible elf on the field that hasn't moved, yeah, um, that's a three plus to get there. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And of course, he's banging that one first. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't like this halfway house between. The well, it looks like he's doing it. It looks like he's away from the tail. I mean, it's a shit foul now. And that guy blocks his path. Yeah. Does he? Mm -hmm. yeah, well, that's fine. Over there, he did, yeah. But oh, it's, fi it's fine. It's fine. I, mean, I guess the plan was we will keep our best player safe by having another player there. So it's only mm -hmm. one die, which is yeah. that's going to work. Him that's going to yeah. be fine. I mean, Rick, yeah. yeah, Rick would be pretty crazy to be blitzing that deep. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, yeah he, he screened it off. That's, that's it. His plan was to screen it all off, but you I, know what? that all had to work, didn't it? You know what? I think it's I think it's screen in front and foul the guard dodger on the floor. Because if it didn't, the crops could have come around to cancel the assist, and then he could have hit the best player. Yeah, um, I'd, I'd, I'd kind of hate having relying on three plus without it. Well, I, I hate to give all that potential, but does any of this actually <laughs> matter? Rick is so screwed. He doesn't he, have his super skinks. He's going to start ones, fouling. So. He's, he's going to foul with the loner skink. He's going to foul the guard on the floor, and then he's going to just try and get back into it through fouling. Yeah, I, I want to live in a world so where the loner skinks get it done. I just, I'm not sure I do. Is he going to blitz the crops? Country president. <laughs> God. Probably. Yeah, he might. There you are, big well, no, no, You can gonna, pick up no, politics. He's going <laughs> yeah. to blitz with the mighty blow block, or something. No? Uh, no, 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 the crops, because he's got the skink in. I don't yeah. know why you're marking this guy with a skink. Unless, oh, unless you want to. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't have hated the crocs with the 3D blitz on the sidestepper in the middle and then getting the crocs in around the side as well. I mean, I suppose we might be fouling the guard piece. If not, he's, I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, he's 100%. Very well. He's 100% fouling that guard. I know. Whoa, he's, he's gone the witch. Gets the power. Oh, wow. 
AV7, well, mighty blow. He, it's it's mm -hmm. the square he wanted to get to anyway. No Apo. And for Oh, and he's, he's actually screened the right side as well without yeah. him punching the guard yep. for us. Just a stun. Iced. And even the Saurus standing up at the back does create that. You know, he, I mean, Rick's got to look at the 1 in 36 fails here, doesn't he? Because. And he hasn't got much else. Foul, yeah. A foul does come in. I really like this turn from yeah, Rick. The, yeah, so it's I really, nice. Really like this turn. But it's, because it's turn 10, there's still plenty of time. You can just blitz this guy yeah. and can move at the side, block him, even could block him yeah. potentially. So mm -hmm. it's an easy turn to go over this side from Tempest Sun. I mean, I, uh, yeah, I, I think. step if I'd gone forward at the turn where I wanted to, where there was a huge amount of space, we could have easily stalled at the far end, having reversed the field, but this is fine. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Rick's got a lot of stuff over, so, you know. I think, I think he can just ignore that guard, uh, block Saurus, and then. Almost dodge off and blitz the skin, can him like sort of screen off the right, the right hand side. No, I blitz through the block Saurus and just head over to the right. Okay. It's fine. Yeah, and just mill over here. Two, Turn three, eleven, you got five, plenty of time. Seven. Yeah, I think. Okay, yeah, I agree. And then towards the end, the blodge step and the rookie. Once I'm safe over on the right, I can look at advancing them up the right hand flank. We could surf him. <laughs> oh, he didn't blitz. The blitz now. Yeah. No, the blitz isn't so good, though, is it? Okay. No, if no, those two had been isn't. a pow, it was. It, they'd have been yep. a nice shape as the left-hand side of his defence for where he wants to go. Yep. But now it's got to be the blitz, sadly, I think. And that lino has got to stay on the crocs. If that had been mm -hmm. a pow, you, see, you could have blitzed the um, the loner skink, couldn't you? And then gone way up that right side with those two elves and still had the ball safe. Oh, this is. That's a very rowdy position, but. The Isn't this? Uh, yeah, this is fine. This is all still fine. Like he's out. Is it? Do it every once. Yeah, it's fine. Is it? It's fine. It's yeah, not if he rolls the one in nine on that lino. He's not going to dodge the lino. He's, he's not. He's, no, he's, he's not going to dodge the lino. Not the well, then rips up in hill in it, and then he's. All right, he has to stay. He can't follow that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. Yeah. And, and then, then he can, can push the blitzer stand. forwards if he wants. I'd say I bring would. Back to stand, uh, I think you'll bring him back, but I'd push him forward. Two squares, in, two squares in front of that lino on the yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Fly out yeah, the right yeah, wing, yeah, Rick. Yeah, Good yeah. job. Well, that's okay, what, I'd go a little further, but that's safe. Yeah, but this makes a screen, right? Otherwise, yeah, yeah. 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 This is fine. Right. And yet, still needs responding to. Here. It's a good square. Two plus hand off to that, and it's gone, and you've lost. Great spot, great spot there, Demi. Yep. So one GFI. That's the right square, Dim. One yep. GFI, and he, he can do all that. He could just leave him there as well. But one GFI is yeah, slightly better, right? Yeah, yeah I, I think I, it's worth rolling a one. Nope. Yeah, I think. I think so. Yeah, it's slightly better, but it's it's still okay. It still puts a, a big pain on where those sauruses over the left can move. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's not it's not worth rolling the two plus. But like, almost if, if like... he had the movement out, if he had the movement, I would have put in there. But obviously, Rick, you're not going to try the one with the two plus. I think he's uh, underestimated the move of Silly Billy, though, Jim. Because <laughs> yeah, he's he moved seven, isn't the he? Other side of he it, did, yeah. man, yeah. Oh, he, could have, uh, he could have opted to show a bit of leg down that right side that last turn. Uh, left it open rather oh, than yes. shutting it down. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. maybe his turn was Until too I'm good. Victorious. Yeah, maybe. And maybe. I will defend. I will defend. Like if you just bait him in, mind you, then you <laughs> do bait him in. Thank you very much, Doug the Minotaur, staying fantastic oh. for a whole year. Oh my god, three oh, beaver wow. pregnancies, absolutely glorious. Thank you so much. It's no wow. problem, just load a reroll it. Look That's at Rick, what a legend, what a legend he is. Oh my god. It doesn't need worrying about it, it's just, no. yeah. you've got rerolls. Wow. Half the time that's fine, or all the time if you're Rick. Yep. Classic Rick oh, dice. Wow. So that's why I would have pushed this blitzer forward. It would invite the loner around the corner, um, and uh -huh. it would be impossible to get in front of it. But it's, again, the Dark Elves are in such a strong position that taking any sort of risk just doesn't seem like it's a good idea, does it? No. Yeah. It's much more likely you'd screw it up than, I mean, this feels like an already won game. It After feels like it, but it isn't, is it? You know, he's, no, it like isn't. he's down man. No. It's, uh... Oh, he's three dice in this, lad. Okay. Yeah. Well, yes, that happened. Okay. I mean, it was with Mighty Blow, so it's obviously the right thing to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
It's just the fact mm. I'd kind of be taking it out. But. Yeah, it's nine aside. It's nine aside. So if you if you can remove a player, you get the. Player. He's gonna he foul it. Yeah, oh, he's no, he's not. Yeah, he is. Yeah. He's gonna foul the witch. I see. Yeah. There we go. Oh, there we go. There you go. He's got one. Easy. Yeah. Got him. Oh, oh. Apple and comes in Apple's for overtime. Yep. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that is a negative apple, isn't it? Uh, I mean, I would have about it to win the game. Are you think but he's that? It's only winning head? you the game if it's only winning if you the game. If it goes, game, to, overtime, if it goes to overtime, sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jim's point yeah. is he may have saved it for a, a KO, KO later or, in this drive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or or a perm. Like like this is like the worst of all worlds, right? This is you just thinking I'm not going to score on my drive, and then I'll have another player for sure. overtime. It's like it's. I would have rather yes. rifled this guy than him. Yeah, it, it was very quick. Maybe uh, he might regret it now. Maybe. Well, I still fly up this right flank, which I would have done ages ago, but then I would be you know, struggling to defend my stall. Mm. Yeah. But I'd rather struggle to defend a stall than struggle to push through. Because if you screw up here, it, it's not unthinkable that the loner can keep it long enough to get over the line. Yeah, this this is a pretty easy, pretty easy. Yeah. Round. It's still always been pretty easy, but yeah, it somehow thing, isn't yeah. quite coming together yet. Yeah. Mm. I, mean, I don't. I don't hate it. Mm -hmm. you just put him in, blitz with him. Go up there. Go up there. Go up there. I don't know if you saw much of the first half, Dimmy, but okay, this game um, was won, and Rick just decided it wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it was I didn't crazy. see it, but I could believe it. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Rick rolled all the dice. Is he switching back to the left here? Yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah. I hate this. Which That's I... ballsy. <laughs> okay, so the plus <laughs> side is that the dodge guard again can 3-2 out uh, and get relevant up over the halfway line, which is nice. The bludge step over the right can, towards the end, dodge out and head forwards over the line of scrimmage. We can make some penetration into Rick's backfield, which would be a pleasant change at this point in the game. And it's fairly safe. You can get the ball defended before Ooh. you do anything else. I hate so, it. I, I don't know. I don't so know. much better go on the right. Yeah. I, 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 the pro, the pro point is you punch a skink and Reddit will uh, say you've yeah. done the right play. That's about the only positive. Like I think you've it's made the... so much better to go up here and like have it. Yeah. Fully I, I, mean, I, I would be Jim, but I'm just trying to find reasons why he's Fair doing what he's Yeah, doing. fuck knows what the reasons are. Yep. I mean, Fair with play. the Saurus in the backfield, I, I don't think the swap to the left is a good idea, but it... no. It is somewhere you can go without rolling any dice and get safe. Yeah, because if you look it, at the centre line, you, you've got you've got all your players over here, right? Like yeah. You've got all your players over here. He's got players here as well. He's got his crocs, you know, where the tail is all on, on this side. <laughs> it's just it's made it's, it's made <laughs> all of the team relevant is the problem. Yeah. With the only choice to me was do you blitz the Saurus nearest to you or the or one up ahead of the the, the block okay. step piece? Yeah, no, I would have blitzed, I would've, I would've, I would've I would've blitzed yeah, I would have blitzed, blitzed the, the furthest. <laughs> you, so, no, I, I would have blitzed the nearest and used the lino as the assist exactly. to block the one at the front. Exactly, yeah, at yeah. the back. Yeah, yeah. See, I'd be blitzing that one off that piece and then running up with him. But, I mean, maybe it's too soon because Silly Billy, obviously, with his huge move, could get up ahead of you. <laughs> yeah, I just use them all to protect the ball, yeah. yeah. But this is what he's doing. He is swapping back into a very safe cage. Mm. And who's to say it's wrong? He's still working the space. He's still got four turns after this. He just needs to outmaneuver them once, and he's gone. Yeah, he's just he's needs... running out of time. That's not good. I'm tell you, that's the wrong. The wrong move is run out of time. He has to not run out of time. So this one penetrates the backfield. Yeah. Yeah, and then this guy, yeah, the attack with a dodge guy. Oh, so it's three, three two. Two. I think that's three, two, three. Yeah. 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 And, three, and then two. back, back one and left. This should, yeah. Oh, this no. he should have moved one more square. Yeah. 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 yeah that's the wrong square. Yeah, maybe that was time. Bit. Yeah, yeah maybe down left time. of their one is so much stronger, isn't it? But it's yep. um, still a good solid position. Yeah, it's fine. And it's, I mean, not only is it stronger with the one near the edge, but it's stronger with the dodge piece on the skink. It's so much better square. Box dodge. Ball Whereas bait. it is, it's irrelevant. But where that square, it's it's relevant to two other L's. Beautiful square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is just time, I guess. Yeah, has to be. I think I'd blitz that uh, loner off the or the lineman off the uh, Crocs and see if the Crocs will get uh, will play ball. Oh, he can't come through, can he? The problem no, is, he yeah, can't he can't. Get, he's he's totally hemmed in. I, I, so. I think he's okay. gone. I would have hit the one he's just uh, landed the blockless Ooh. Saurus on. I think you have to get in front Ooh. of that ball, but made a removal. Classic Rick. Yep. There we are. That's a better block blitz because it's with Mighty Blow. 
Yep. Does get rid of like the, uh... block list, right? Great, great blitz. Yeah. Yeah. And it's impactful because it got rid of uh, the relay piece as well. And so, the only goal. So it turns but... out it didn't matter what square that guy would have gone in because he's getting removed anyway. <laughs> yeah. Well, it, even then it did, Jim, because the one that came over and marked the uh, rookie in front of the ball wouldn't have been able to do it. Yeah, not until that blitz had happened. Not yeah. until the blitz had happened. So it would have altered the turn order, which could have made a big change. Yeah. It's nice. We're, uh, impressed with Rick, actually. Yeah, yeah. So going to take Rick's coach to this game brilliantly so far. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah he's definitely played better than Tempest Soul. Yep, Does he pick the practice? I don't know. Probably got to just keep him right because he's he's I doing would. a job like he's screening with yeah. this guy, screening with this guy. It's just too bad if you and like the fact you've got a bit ahead, right? With like yeah. your, your men up and that now, I think yeah, now's the time to. Good. Oh good. no, I think that skink should have gone two to the right of the block source on the dodge guy. So yeah, 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 one down, mm. one yeah, down, and one right. That. On that yeah. Spur. Okay. yeah. yeah. Mm. I don't know. I like I like reinforcing this to be honest because this mm, looks a real. Yeah, real there's so good. few good options here. I'd go through that guy. Yeah. You got the, you got the other skink as well there, so it's it's really hard to hit him. Like. Do you remember like, we had lots of L's and lots of field space, and I said I'd go charging <laughs> up into it. <laughs> yeah, I mean I you would you would really have been in a problem. problem you would have been in a pickle up here instead of down yeah. here, but it's not yeah. that much difference. Now you've got more field to like outpace them if you get away. So like that's why I, that's why I, one of the reasons why I like the Dakar. I don't really think it matters when where where you get into trouble as elves, and in fact oh, it's often better really? to get in trouble deeper because you really? have got that extra space further away. Well, it's too early. It's too early. It's too early. It's not a fast. great idea to get in trouble near your own line because it's an easy wow. score. For them. And I don't, that's I don't true. Mind. That's true end. that it can be easier, but yeah. I I Ooh. feel like that's balanced by the fact that. The you know all this open space behind them. I think that was that was the thing that really blew my mind about it. Like how 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 much space there is here, and it's, that's just great for the elves, right? And I think there is a yeah. counterpoint to that as well, Jim. Which is that if if they've got to drive all the way back from the other end of the field, elves are usually faster and often can get back and mm -hmm. get another go at them. So there are points in both directions. There is definitely a time for the withdrawn offense. Here, I think he found the outmaneuvering space that should have gone earlier. But we'll never know. He didn't. So it's, it's fast. Fine, it was like did. just turn ten, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I, and I, like I, he has, I don't think he's played well after that, right? Which has come, made it look even worse that he's like yeah. hasn't tit gone it. Do you know what I mean? Like that's the thing. Yeah, I, I mean this move left none of us liked. Yeah, we all no. agreed that was definitely the time to head up well, the right I'm side. Not a particularly big fan of this swap back right, to be honest with you. I mean that guy could have got there. He could have done this, all of this, without using I, the lineman and uh, and just made some dodges. Yeah. Yeah. Well. yeah. 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 I mean, he's got movement seven blodge. It's probably but not again, always get an upside. Punished. The fact he's not that Saurus over, uh, being an elf, he'll figure he can leave it behind, whereas it'll have to stand up. But he it's might be looking for that here. edge because he's got oh, down numbers. I thought he was gonna dodge that guy. So good, but he no, gets he, the punch he, of skink. There's a skink to hit, Dimmy. You oh. keep up. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's always getting hit in this My game. Back to here. No, I no, he you. has to be in range. But he can't dodge off the cross. So no, 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 no. The, the yeah, so that one has to, has to come back. Yeah, he, he needs to be in range. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, no, that, you're not, you, good. at this you point, you definitely you can't range. score now. Get You've lost too many L's. You need to win the game this drive. Although well, he's got two on the bench coming back and one KO. Yeah, yeah there's actually more terrible. elves here than we realise. Yeah, it's not that terrible. So you know, maybe his maybe his apple's looking great right now. Well, he's currently capped at 10, is it? Yeah, there is actually still 7 on the pitch. Yeah. And Rick's on 9 still. And yeah, Rick having 10. looked really Ooh. short this half um, has just stayed there, hasn't he? Yeah, he's high rolled a bit, hasn't he? He got, he got the foul that made a casual yeah. stuff. Like he's, yeah. he's, he's, he's done the right thing. Like Rick is, Rick is really good at recognising when he's behind and when he has to take Absolutely. desperate measures. Yep. I mean, in terms of gear change, which I talked about with Elliot, Rick does that seamlessly, constantly. Well, I mean, to be Safe fair, Rick's, Rick's default gear is, is is a lot higher than Elliot, so maybe that makes it easier. But yeah, yes. Rick is great at, at recognising when he has oh. to high roll. Well, generally. Yeah. Oh. But Rick also knows when to tighten yeah. up and just take what he's got. I was just about to say I was going to three-die that guy, um, but he's just two-dized him and got him with 
Silly Billy, which is pretty nice. Hard you just three. wasted two assists. That's yeah. <laughs> three assists. Yeah, it's really hard to three dice. Foolish. Like you, you, you need to, you need field coverage here, right? He's still in yeah, his own you half. Do. You have to, you have to yeah. stop penetration. This is why, I, this is why I liked him deeper as a scoring threat because it's forcing mm -hmm. him back. Like Rick can just reform now. Yeah, but if you don't go there, then he then he can go and get the ball off you, which you don't really want him to do. No, I don't but think if he reforms right. centrally, which I hope he does, then Tempest finally has the opportunity to use his elves with Blodstead to instead of just hit skip, oh, he's fouling this game. He's fouling. Move yeah. them all over to one side and screen as he moves forward to try and win the game. This, might, really be, this might lose it for Rick. This foul. It would be it massive irony be. if the Dark Elves <laughs> uh, just uh, won by nothing. <laughs> I think you could have lost it because uh, he can actually get up now, you know, like with again, like saying he needed that field coverage, now he doesn't have it. Yeah, yeah I, I prefer I preferred that elf being further down the pitch. Like the wrong end, you know what I mean? Like towards the Yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying. This is yes. this is now we're now at very you near stretch, critical elf. Yeah, stretch the lizards, man, like. You've still got three blood step blitzers to protect your blood step witch as you head up the right hand side. It's going to sideline cage, isn't it? It's going to be just the... Uh... The problem is silly Billy with a stun firm, isn't it? Yeah. Well, like, you just hand off to the AG5 and go, all right, silly Billy, stand firm, and I'll walk past you. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, he can get in the way, and then you can't move him, and then everything else, it's like you've got up hills, and you might be able to... So I'd, I'd run the AG5 to the sideline, I'd hand him off with a witch, and I'd dodge the other geezer out and just sideline cage and go, go on, lizard, sort that out. Yeah. Yeah. Because we did run the piece back, and I, I, I mean, I, I see Dimmy's point, keeping it deep. I wanted it deep early for the same reason, to split the focus. I think perhaps would have helped, but. Is that about? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Where's he going? To try and stop this guy coming up here. Uh, I guess. So, yeah. yeah. Cool, cool, cool. So he can ah. still just come out here. So, we're yeah. side like we're sidelining that right hand side, mate. If yeah. if we. No, yeah. I agree. I agree, Dimmy. Yep, you can get him over the halfway line. He can come one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you can have you can have him. You can have yep. ball carry there with Edge Five. Two players here, yep. and then you yep. can still try and get him out, and you can still try and get him out to tag the Crocs, and you can still try and get him out as well. So you can. Oh, I mean the 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 one that's down and the one on the Crocs are not that hard to imagine getting out. The one that's mm -hmm. down, it's a three plus with inbuilt reroll and two plus. Yep. The one that's on two, the Crocs, two. it's a four two. I mean, these are not difficult roles, so it's a one in four fail to get off the mm -hmm. crops. So it, it should all still happen. But should isn't the same as will. No. And then you said you've the actually only one dodge to get a sideline cage that's pretty safe, and then you just keep adding to it. Yeah. Do you have to start with the blitzer in the center though? Uh, for the two plus off to make the top of the cage and then the and then and then you put the edge five against the line and then you hand off to him, right? Yeah. It's like two Terrible one in thirty. I think I'll move. I think I'll yeah. move the edge five first. Everything after that is just whatever. I think I'll move the edge five first, just so he's in kind of scoring range. <laughs> he's, he's, he's not giving it to the edge five. Mm. No. And he's not giving it to the edge five either. Oh, he's looking to. And he's confident he's going to get out and get a, a more of a cage around it. I mean, I'm confident he is too, but. Yeah, I mean, this is better. This is better risk. if it works. It's better if it works. Yeah, higher risk, kind of. Risk, <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, with a single go for it in front of the witch, yep. from the one that's dodging out in the middle of the three, that's super strong. It is. And then the one on the crocs can close the back door, which isn't that worrying anyway. If somebody wants to run all the way around there, it's fine. Mm. Maybe it doesn't three, even two, dodge two. Him. Yeah, 3 2 2, I'd definitely be doing that. He's tagging the crocs. Yeah, he's got to do this one first. He does. Yeah, I think the cracks, crocs is a decent one to tag. That's the right turn ordering. Mm hmm. You don't have to go ahead of the witch. You could go on the mighty blow piece. Two to the left of the other blood step blitzer. That's a pretty strong square yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, it's not bad at all, is it? Yeah, yeah, I like that actually. On the mighty blow. Yeah, it's really nice. You could just stay there. Yeah, he's just, just stay uh, there. one up. Yeah. One there up. isn't terrible either, but as Dodge hasn't wow. popped, I would want to get on the mighty blow. Oh, he's just staying there, is he? Oh. Yeah, it's, it's, this it's guy a strong square. Yeah, nice. Because whilst it doesn't cut off Silly Billy and the Mighty Blow, it does cut off two other Sauruses from the diagonal they really want to do. I think that's the best turn he's played. Yeah, yeah. that's nice. Yeah. Stretch the cloakers. <laughs> Indeed, Red. <laughs> I, I, he didn't even make a block. 
Yeah, shocking. Yeah. So you mean all the turns where he did all that hitting, we didn't like as much. And the one we just did lots of elf stuff we think was his yep, best turn. Yeah, was his best turn. Mm. Crazy, that, Kalon. Crazy. How does that make so... sense, though? Because, <laughs> you know, he banged on men's and that's... I know. Oh, I don't know about this. Yeah, I'm not sure this. either. Yeah. The... I mean, it's it's a screen, but it's got a lot of loner skinks in it. I, I'm, I'm not alone in seeing that, right? Well, he's going to park Silly Billy in front, right? Yeah. It's Silly Billy on the line, and that sort is yeah. there. Yeah, that tightens it up. Mm -hmm. Silly, Silly Billy, Billy, Billy has to go in front of that lone skink. Lone yeah. skink, yeah. 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 He, should have, he should have done before that guy as well. Yeah, but Thankfully, but then... he's moved seven, so he's actually able to make it around. <laughs> he's going to blitz with him. Ah. Oh, I don't That's like this. Uh, oh, he's, got he's got a grab, he's got a grab, he's got a grab. He's got a grab, he's got a grab. He's got a grab. So he can be two in front of the loner. Uh, he's got a grab. Because, really because as well as grab, he's got move seven. So he's one in nine would have been so terrible, still though. So I still don't like terrible. it, though, because, yeah, the one yeah. in nine would have been horrendous. Like, he yeah, just yeah. loses on a one in nine, basically. Yeah. But then maybe it's worth it, right? Maybe that's worth it. That's Do you remember how I said I was looking forward to seeing how Rick sorts all this out? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty not. It's, pretty great. We're seeing it. This is not a no, bad no, position no. he's left himself in. I don't think it's that. I don't think you can take the hit on the blood step though. I think you just stand there. Uh, yeah, I concur. Yeah, you can't hit the blood step. I think if he if he got the it's one in ninety, thirty percent, which would be yeah. lovely, but ev everything else is awful. Yep. yep. I mean, like he's got a free. He's got a free. Oh, it's not free, is it? No. I mean, this isn't pretty, oh. but you can come through the Saurus in the middle of the field. Yeah, red dice the Saurus in the middle. Yeah, the red, red dicing him, yeah. Red yeah. dicing him is great if, if it works. Otherwise, you, you can just push, potato with this. You can but... just potato with Edge 5. Yes, I mean, the Edge 5 can definitely get past Silly Billy and then blitz through the Loner Skink. Mm -hmm. And then you can try and bring some cover up afterwards. You've got two blood steps that only then need to get past Silly Billy. That's not terrible either. You could, um, you could you could blitz with him through here, right? You could you could you could go through there, or just or just run through, run through the middle, run through the middle. Well, that's the Saurus I was thinking of, not the one that's further back. Well, well I mean, I mean, not Silly Billy. You you said like go through Silly Billy. Oh, you mean just run through? Yeah, yeah. yeah you could just run yeah, through, or he could blitz through. through, or he could do all sorts of things. Just go for the Reds. No, he's just going straight through. For That's the screen for one dying oh, yeah, through that Saurus. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. Mm. Was this a, was well, this was my to... original plan. Let's mm. see if it works. Oh, the mm. Dublin skulls! No, it does not work. Boy, howdy. Boy, no, howdy I don't, I right. don't believe in, in dice swappable from one plan to another, but that means no. any dodge through to hit the skink wouldn't have worked if you believe in that sort of thing. <laughs> you sure? But Actually, I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I thought Jim's plan of just go past um, Silly Billy and blitz the loner skinks pretty strong. Well, I I I, I didn't really like Silly Billy. I thought I thought go through go through this way. Go through yeah. diagonally. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But I mean, again, I would have. What I really would have wanted to have done was to play every single turn previous different <laughs> <laughs> differently. <Yes. laughs> Well, I'd have wanted to get forward a little earlier, but it would have led to a very different game where you're fending Rick off to score so, rather than... Yeah. Cannot through, afford but... to hit. Is, is he in range? No, he's not. He's going to power this guy. Seven, so he's not... Oh, yeah. wow. He's going to power, power him straight he'll, away. He'll, Block yeah, his power. Now he'll power the witch as well. Yeah. Oh, baby. I wasn't kidding. I'm looking forward to how Rick solves this, not does mm -hmm. Rick solve this. Mm -hmm. Of course, of course. Does he make it 3D on the witch is the question. I, I, I certainly would. Yeah. I would be. You yeah. would be. I'm not park, sure uh, if you'd be. Park Silly Billy. I think you can bring the guard. Well, it just gives you so much more if you don't. Yeah. Like, that's the thing. It's like it's yeah, so much Yeah, parking Silly Billy in front and the skink on the sideline. So the sidestep has to not be full. bring the guard in. so strong. Bring the bring guard two guards in, in and still hit yeah. with a Taurus. Yeah. So he comes in there and then you bring the other guard in as well. Uh, it should be all of you Saurus, this is the problem, isn't it? All like yep, a skink right, as well, yeah. like, so it's yeah, just yeah. you're putting in so much in one place. Yeah, I don't, like, I would rather have said it move after. But the problem is you've you've got a power blodger, so like, it's, mm -hmm. it's pick your poison, isn't it? Neither one's good. This isn't three. Yeah, so here we go. Oh, it is now. Good, yep. 
Got to hit with mighty, right? <laughs> Have to hit with mighty. Put the reroll in, or just block? That's the question. It's interesting. It's his last reroll, gone into overtime. Uh, you've got to get to overtime. And yeah. Are you going to yeah, get but... overtime if you don't? To just park the skink behind. Oh, uh, I think. But you can always just hand off to that uh, guy in front on a four plus, and he can fuck off. Yeah, it's so just the on it. One, one skink like here and one mm -hmm. here. Yeah. Or one behind, and then one somewhere else. It's it's tricky. It's awful. Yeah, that's nice. The elves, the the elves can definitely score. This guy's in range. Isn't he? No, he's, he's in not range. in range. He's not in range. Oh, he's, he's one shy. So he just can't hit. Just don't hit him. Yeah, you cannot hit him. No. But he can. He can hit. He can hit to get him in range. So yeah, he, he could. He, he could be in range. He can chain him in. Yeah. Yeah, you can chain him in range. So you've got to dodge. So what you have to do, actually, so oh, what Rick has to do right. is dodge. Oh, is dodge, dodge out with a saurus. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. That's quite... You know, Silly Billy has grab, yes. <laughs> but he's got to eat. You can't hit this guy. <laughs> For a level. With What's not that? Silly Billy. Oh, so close. So this guy has to just dodge. That, that, that's Another the thing that Rick gone. has to do. No, Rick had to dodge this guy. He had yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, is yeah. like too easy, right? You dodge him to there, and then he can go one, two, three, four. Oh, no, he can't reach. So he gotcha. goes to here. Yeah. And then. Well, it's not, it's okay, it's not that easy, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, so it's doable. It's not easy. I don't hate the four plus handoff here. Sure, but that guy's not in range, right? Yeah, it doesn't, yeah. It doesn't do anything. Same That's 16, the thing. Oh, and 16. then, then the plus agility just has to run into the end zone, and then I'm three two. He can't run into the end zone. Range? That's you've got to chain him, PC. Oh, so, he's got to be so, chained. Ah, sorry, yeah. I was just talking to my daughter. I see. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so you, you've got to right. dodge this guy. This guy's got a three two to there. Yeah. Stand him up. This guy goes three two, another two, double GFI, chain him to here. No, 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 no. no. You dodge, okay, you dodge right the guy off Silly Billy on a 3-2 and put yep. him up there and then you dodge the other guy on the floor, double GFI and blitz the middle square through the Saurus. Okay. What? So, it is a blitzer. It has no, it the range. Does, it, it puts but, him on a skink though. Oh no, he sidestep. He sidestep. Mm, so side you get a bow, well, then it's fine. I don't know what you're talking about. Didn't you? so, so the blitzer next to Silly Billy, 3 2 the the top, out yeah. and goes on top of the edge 5 guy. And then so you three twos. How does he three two? No, no, the dodge, blitz, no, the three two belly. dodge out. So you dodge forward. Three plus two plus. And then two plus, and then you go all the way around around the top, and then this guy is the blitzer, and he yep. blitzes from the side, from the left. Yeah. You make the T. Which is another three two, and then a go for it too. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. so this one, you were saying. Yeah, he's the blitzer. He should be the, the blitzer. blitzer. Yeah, and he, he, no, he can just go one. here. He can just. What? No. no, no, he blitzes from the left of the Saurus. I don't know what either of you are talking about. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I it's got fine, it, Jimmy, I got it. And it yeah, yeah, me too. Sense. You're right, Dimmy. I thought that was the best plan. Yeah. I like Nightmare. And then the witch has to 4 3 2 through it out, doesn't she? I like Nightmare. I don't know what. Oh, no, she can come back and then turn the corner and throw it, to be honest. She can come around the corner. This is what I saw. Oh, and he did. Yep, yep, that's your. that was your play, yep. So imagine that guy was in stand, stood, that guy who just did the blitz was stood on top of the agility five, just yeah, the right yeah, one, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then it, the guy who dodged out from the saurus in the under, on the bottom uh, w came into the left and did the push in, and yes. then get the chain that way. No, it's not as good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I right. think controversially it ends up with exactly the same dice both of those. I think plans. it does. I think <laughs> it does. <laughs> yeah. um, so I, I think it's exactly as good. Um, mm -hmm. But it didn't work. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm sure and we'd need a much not. longer look at it to be certain. Nice surf here. Yeah. He did a GFI to get that. Sorry. You did a GFI to get that. So yeah. Oh, gets the injury as well. Pretty good. It's fine, Jim. Don't worry about it. It was the same dice. He did it two wasn't, GFIs. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't. So. Oh, no, it was. It was. It's yeah, it was. Yeah. It's fine. The blitz of three twoing out had to either way, and one of them yeah. had to do two G GFIs to get the blitz. It was the same dice. Oh, it's fucking umtil and umfill. Oh my god! Wow! I'm, I'm, no wonder I'm bamboozled. Right, where's the ball yeah. gone? Oh, uh, oh yeah, he's still, still got a chance. He's still got a chance. 
No, he hasn't. It's, <laughs> turn it's Rick's turn 16. It's he Rick's turn. He's got a chance. He could have powered oh, him. Oh, yes, he, got oh, right, right. he could have oh, powered right. him, and then he could have hit a skink and a skink, yes, and yes, he could have yes, scored. Yes. <laughs> we thought you were he, saying the other way around. He doesn't yeah. get the 30% dice. Yeah. No. It will go to overtime. We can That's disagree about the ball. That's pretty fucking hilarious that the, uh, tiny percentages. the agility is, 5 Is he going to foul the sidestepper? I... Mm. I think the more it's, important question to me is not a decision. It's 50 plus 50. Oh, he's going to foul the... Does the killer the... skin come back? He's fouling. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, it's huge. It's huge. This the 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 kick off is huge and the skink is huge. <laughs> and, well, I mean, the dark elves have three KOs. That's huge. But the killer skink may be bigger than all of them. Two oh, I know the answer. Cracking game, blood ball. It like. is. Yeah, Smart. brilliant. Two elves come back. Oh, for God's sake, PC. <laughs> no, it's all right. <laughs> no, you just saw that. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Riggs won the toss. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. But the killer skink does not come back. It's so it's nine lizards and only two loners to handle the ball with one yeah. reroll. Oh, awful. And he's got against kick. eight elves with one reroll. Yeah, it's going to be a touchback, though. <laughs> well, he's got kick, mate. So I was looking forward to how Rick solved the second half, and I was delighted with how that happened. <laughs> Changing um, weather, Kalon. Changing weather. Oh, yeah, yep. Yeah, there we go. Now, let, I, now I've got no idea what's happening over time. I don't know if Rick wins or not. <laughs> My mystic powers are to end. I mean, he could just be safe. Yeah, he could yeah. just be safe. He could just go what one, two, three, four, five. He could just aim here, right? And then it can't. It can't be a touchback. Did uh, PC Did he got one one at the start of the second half? I predicted that Rick would solve it, and there would not. He would not lose. That's that's <laughs> mystical. That was ahead of the ball. Do you yeah. have a bribe? Is that why uh, the game crashes? Uh, I also predict that the uh, sun will come up tomorrow. <laughs> wow. Well, yes, I didn't consider it very unlikely that very unlikely Rick wouldn't find the right dice, but he did. <laughs> okay, so a very standard Dark Elf defense here. We've got the three on the line split so as not to try and stay too many on the Cropsicle's tail. Three straight behind that are the most aggressive actioning elves and then blood steppers out wide to try and stop the quick move down the flank. Pretty Rick, good. of course, has to pick up, probably on a loner skink. Though maybe he'll do it with a Saurus. I mean, it is Rick. I'm no. talking away and I'm muted. Um, kick should, kick, kick yeah. could have been in the middle, right? So he had he had all four side steppers on the wings. Like he's made yeah, a kind of that. imbalanced with having a weak yep. a weak link here. But it doesn't look like he's set up to. Uh, what's, what's, the, like? what's the what's the SPP on that um, skillless Saurus? <laughs> 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 uh, he's, he's fully on fully on zero. Oh. oh, oh! Well, we've got a gap. We have a gap on the side he'd set up for. Oh, but that's a fucking terrible kick. Oh my side god! Line. Loner pick up on the sideline. Loner side pick line. up on the sideline. Wow! Oof. With blood step elves in range. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can get silly Billy over there. And, and I think yes. <laughs> at least the edge five is it. done. <laughs> that was an all right kick off result. Wasn't it? Fantastic yeah. results. Yeah, he can probably go and foul him to be honest with you, lads. I was going to say. Rick. Does he not pull his midfield skink into picking up? And if that works, Who the other loner into fouling the agility five. Well, no, because he no, you, you take the Saurus, block, yeah. the Saurus hit, or the Croxagor hit, because the, the Croxagor needs a one point for a level. So yeah. obviously that's that takes. Obviously, silly that's Billy has to just secure the Saurus. Has to go over there. Yeah, yeah. has, has to. to. Yeah, no two, to, choice, two yeah. to the left of where that other Saurus has just exactly. moved to, so that if you fail it and it doesn't go out, it's... Oh my god, other. he did do it. Oh, Jesus Christ, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh my oh. god. Oh my god. Have you rolled many 1 in 27s, Jim? Yep. Yeah, a couple. Yeah, me too. Couple. Yeah, me too. You just have yeah. to have Silly Billy over here. Like, you have to. <laughs> so funny. He's going to blitz a Silly Billy, isn't he? That's why he, he is. Yeah. yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah he is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's got grab, you know. <laughs> and yeah. he's movement seven. <laughs> I'm going to forget he's got fucking back. stand firm and guard at the end of this. <laughs> so good. Yeah, here we go. Here's the blitz. The loner on gets a bludger. And gets the bow. Of course he does. Oh. He gets the removal. Oh, wow. Of course, any Saurus could have done this, but at least it was silly, yep. Billy. Yeah. <laughs> It's oh, just, wow. it's, it's just, if the loader's going to pick it up fine, he's just going to yeah, run through, isn't he? It's going to yeah. be fine. I mean, I'd really like for him to drop Silly Billy back a square. 
serenely wander down nope. this field against Still such an there. excellent Dark Elf team <laughs> and win. He does really need the pickup. Yeah. Doesn't need to do the skink, I guess, in case of a throw in. Oh, lads. I mean, you've got it. You've oh, got to lads, it, right? you have you've to, right? You yeah. can't re really roll that on a loner. <gasps> Two out of three, it's nowhere near an elf. Well, it, our, you know, out. it just goes directly where an elf can pick it up. Yep. It goes directly where an elf can pick it up. You had to reroll that, I think. I, I, well, it only goes in the crowd three. It only goes in yeah. the crowd three times out of it. Okay. Yep. Okay. And then if it's and a, then it goes in. Yep. And then of the three throws, the it's one fine. up towards the elves. If it's there, unless it's, it's like an eleven or twelve, there. it's probably fine. If okay. it's backwards, it's fine. it's fine. If it's sideways, yeah. it's fine. Unless it's at least as you know, well, exactly as long as it was. Hmm. So yeah. Rick's got unlucky there with the throw in. Well, with yeah. that event out and with the Fair throw enough. position. Yeah, but my, my initial reaction was you have to reroll, but yeah, upon further consideration, I do. And even the diagonally forwards should have been safe, shouldn't it? There's sauruses mm, all over that diagonal area. The most should. Yeah. The you know, average would have got it next to the seven. The average seven, would have yeah, landed on, straight on, on the witch. On, straight on her, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Maybe not. Mm. But can you really put your only reroll into a loner pickup? What a cruel game. Yeah, not really, right? So that's the thing. And, the I think, uh, and you know, five times out of eight, it's here and totally fine. Yeah, so, and he's yep. removed the threats on that yep. side. Yep, yep. What a cool game. Well. I mean, it's um, by no means over. I don't know why we're... Oh, no, yes, wow. I do. I was going to say, I don't know why we're doing this hit first, but it all made sense to me as soon as I said it. Yeah, yeah, you can, you've got it. You, I mean, it clears the path. I mean, he literally could have just, on a push, was blocking the path of the guy to pick up the ball, though, right? Yeah, I know. It was. Is he, is he going to fire it back to the witch? There we are. Is he going to fire it back to the witch? I would have done that. I would have done that, Blitz. Okay. That, that, that witch is the ball going up first, and then pick the ball up first, no, and then. No, 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 no. The witch is going. Oh, I don't know about that. No, you can't stop there. You're on the right. Oh, no. Okay, because. No, you can't. Yeah, he can fire it back. He throws it back, so. He picks it up with a blitzer, throws it back, and then dodges off the crocs. And yeah. If I'm throwing that anywhere, I'm throwing that to the bottom right corner because both my witch and blitzer can win the race there against one load of skink. Yeah, but now he's in a cage. Well, yeah, if, two if you make the roll. If you make there the roll, he's in a cage. Okay. Easy. Easy. That's exactly yeah, what I'm doing. Yeah. Cool. Demarat yeah. called it again. Yeah, I like that. All right. Uh, well, that's very good. Whew. I think no that. Record. Well, it so was Rick. It was Rick by a mile, and now it's Tempest yeah. Soul by a mile. <laughs> well, you can put the Crocs on the ball very easily, so that's probably what Rick will do, and then get the Skink back in front of it. But of course, it is a Leap Witch. Mm. Well, I'd love that to be suddenly relevant. Well, it's a three plus half with built in reroll rather than the three plus Leap, but yeah. I think he might have to. Uh... Saurus. You can see how see how difficult it comes. It might it might be it might be able to. Saurus dodge. No, he's not doing I, it. Uh, yeah, I, 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 I would have gone. For she, Saurus she's dodge. two GFIs away, right? She's yeah. yeah, but if you're doing the Saurus dodge, you move other things first. Yes, exactly. Yeah. When like he the stood up the Saurus, he stood up the Saurus the and first and action, so yeah, it's not that. Yeah, in that square, you'd put the Crocs, so that means the Crocs mm -hmm. is blitzing. And you don't GFI anyway, do you? You hand off. Nope. So silly, silly Billy's going for it. It's because of the grab again. He's grabbing, uh, his, yeah. he's grabbing the sidestepper to open this up Boom. a lot in front. Course God, he's got more use out of grab than I've ever seen in a game. Before. Yeah, man. Yep. 100%. Rick always does. Like, he always mm -hmm. does get value out of the grab. And that puts the fair. Crocs on the ball as soon as the Loader Skink's moved. Oh, he's there. And then he can put the hmm. GFI with this guy. Yep. Mm. And this one yeah, can go yeah. over here somewhere. This one can go there. This I think one can I'd, go there. I put the I put the loner uh, the other side of the witch. One yeah, or two. The loner one like two two away. Yeah, from yeah. the witch. Yeah. Uh, no, up up behind her. Yeah. To make the dodge out harder. Oh no no no! He's no, not behind her. You can't leap, go behind leap, her. Leap. She's got to go forward. She's got to go forward. She's got no lateral movement, so she has to go forward. Oh, right, she, yeah, has so put it, she has so to leave. She has to leave and just go line. forward. So you have to yeah, like, put okay, it cool. so here. There. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Yep. So, cool. So a knight's move down right of that guard saurus yep. for me. Yep. Yeah. And then this or one, one in from them maybe no, down there because you've got to bring the other people into. Yeah, he needs square. something. He needs something behind the guard saurus. Otherwise, yeah, it's uh, yeah, three, three, two, two. You guys were right, and he went into the square. I thought. 
Yeah, yeah, that's the wrong square. I'd be too that's bad. That's hundred percent the wrong square. Yeah, it's just a three plus two. Well, three two two to win, isn't it now? Yeah. Yeah, that is fatal. Yep. And there's nothing that can get over and cover that space, so it is a three two two, and we'll stay that way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, Rick will probably get away with it. Or... Whereas you could probably, have put yeah. some we'll cover we'll on the space behind the guard saw us <laughs> with some late GFIs. Well, I mean, a single I mean, yeah. late GFI. Yep, it's the the leapers to think, because otherwise it's a five plus out for Three, yeah, but the two, leap makes two. It a three. Yeah, maybe he missed a leap. Maybe he missed yep. a leap. Yeah, Rick missed leap. No, <laughs> he uses that sort of stuff himself. I'm sure he knows it's there. Just. Oh wow! Wow. He's. Uh, he's he could just put him was here. Was like, that scoring? He can't yeah. score when he goes back, or even yeah, laterally. Yeah. So like, we just we leap, and then as you say, three two two. It's yeah, done. Yeah, three two two. Yeah. Well, there might be some kind of like roll, it's blitz probably and like eighty-five percent or... or something. Blitz a skink mm. first, yeah. Here we go. Yeah. I like that. I like to yeah. blitz a skink first. Yeah, there's no harm in it. It's a one in thirty-six, and it's and it's the scoring. It threat. removes the only scoring threat he's got ahead of the problem area. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, there oh, you go. seventy-seven or eighty-five yeah. is a little bit over the top. And boom, to win. Wow. Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't even yeah. stack them. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, I mean, theory, I mean, maybe he should have stopped if he popped the reroll because yeah, because he could tie yeah, exactly. silly thirty percent to get hit. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, and then he could stab. He could. He could tag silly Billy, and then he could have sidestepped in right if he wasn't yeah. fouled. Yeah. Yeah. Would have been even better if he failed the first one, re-rolled it, and then took the second one. Anyway. Yeah, <laughs> that would be nice, yeah. God damn! I thought Rick played that brilliantly. I thought Terry yeah. really well. Yeah, had some good turns, but some fairly shaky ones too. Big time. Um, poor Rick. I think he really deserved the win, but as so often, that horrible. It's not a word really relevant in Blood Bowl. No, I, I, think, I mean, to, to be fair, Temper Soul's team was a lot better, wasn't it? Like, it was a yeah, lot better. It really was. So, but but Rick did play his ass off, and he was fantastic. Fantastic from Rick, 100%. Yeah, 100% the better player. And, really good uh, game. Played his, played his ass off. That was a great game. Really, yeah. really entertaining. Yep. Yep. So there you go. Uh, if if only, if only he'd won his chalice with Lizard Men and played like that every game. <laughs> Instead of instead of mindlessly claw bombing the victory, because that was a great that was a great match, wasn't it? And uh, yeah, yeah, real really feel sorry for Rick. That was that was a great effort. But yeah, I mean his team, he didn't really have any probably ambitions of winning Chalice this season, did he? With that like with that team, it was a bit of a rubbish team. But it was a it was a great great try at uh, winning this mm -hmm. game. Uh, but congratulations to Tempest Soul, who just about squeaked over the line with his with his with his leap witch. So there you go. Yeah. You know, no offense to Tempest Soul. He, he, like you know, I guess he did have all the advantages, didn't he? And but um, you know, he got it done against all of the Rick dice. So there you go. Congrats to him. Commiserations, Rick. Thank you very much, Kalon Purple Chest and Dimmy G out from his foxhole. What a wonderful Whoa. treat. Real pleasure. Oh, Thanks for having us. Go back to Foxhole now. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.